to uh, I talked to some teams before the game, um, and what what we wanted to do for at least this game was try and pick some maps that we're not so good at. Gotcha. I mean, that um, makes sense. I mean, uh, Breeze just as a whole, everyone's just kind of rusty on with, especially with all the changes, and then we weren't able to play on those changes for very long. Mm -hmm. Looks like our team comp is very interesting. Astro is an interesting pick. I think Omen usually is the way you want to go on Breeze, just mm -hmm. because of those those long blinds and his missile teleporting. Looks like they're stepping away from Astro maybe. The Cypher is a good pick. Sofa is a good pick for clearing those long angles on Breeze. We know that. Mm. I'm also kind of interested in. Never mind. I was gonna comment on Blood uh, yeah. going Deadlock because he likes to play Viper on that Breeze. That is true. And Viper's a pretty good pick. Yeah. Um, and we can see Viper on the other side, uh, Cypher and uh, Sova going out as well. Like I said, those are usually the the classic picks in this map. Some similar picks. Um, we do have Reyna. Uh, some cheese playing Reyna, who I've seen play Reyna a couple times. Yeah. It fits his playstyle very well. You know, not only is he the IGL, but he's also very aggressive, very in your face, uh, which is something that you have to yeah, be when so you're playing Reyna. It looks like we have a double initiator from from Columbia Basin, and then we have a double duelist coming from our team. So this is gonna be a really interesting uh, plays. We'll see uh, how this goes, especially with Sova uh, and Kale. You know, both uh, both. Agents being able to gather uh, data and stuff like that. Yeah, I info. wonder if having that extra intel will give Columbia Basin that advantage. It might give them a for. slight advantage with that with that extra information, but we'll just see because you know they they also have some really good entry. Jet the uh, jet entry is going to be really nice, but yeah, mm. let's get going into this. Uh, I love how fast the computer loads into the game. The computer takes like five minutes to load <laughs> into a game. <laughs> it's so yeah. nice. Why are we spectating? Uh, I think we're gonna yeah, be perfect. Okay, like cool. Okay. Whole game. Yeah. I don't know. I so we're gonna see both perspectives. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. Okay. So it looks like you know they're just going for a. It looks like a Damn. default maybe off the bat, mm. taking the spike to B Damn. by the looks of it. They got the two setups, the cipher and Sova Damn. coming back over. They so yeah. So I think what they're gonna do go for here is a default spike to B. <laughs> so it looks like yeah. nice cam spot from Kiba. I actually didn't know about that one. That's a pretty good. They pause. It must be taking some sort of a uh, temporary timeout. Maybe. Uh, it looks like it's from Columbia Basin, so they getting rid of bubbles. Oh, okay. Yeah. Maybe they're streaming. Has anybody checked to see if Columbia Basin is? Oh god. I'm also interested in seeing um maybe play set uh, for this one. I'm used to too used to playing. Uh, Ah, oh, this well, is a nice spot. That I goes there. Play KJ and I'm this goes here. Ah, oh, this is a nice spot. Play, uh, but I don't think I've seen her play uh, Cyber Bolt. I haven't as well either. So, um, okay, it looks like they're going back into it. So like yeah. I said, it's going to be the default. The Jet's going to take some space on mid. Check if he's there. Offer some support. Mm. Got a nice cam. Look at that. It looks all the way to the top. I don't want to see all the way to mid. There's some more space. Looks like Jet's going to go up on these little pillars right there. Mid. Check some information, try to clear out the top. So the slow caught one. Oh, if I that second on the enemy jet. Thirty seconds left. Yeah. Don't get that peak off, uh, Last player, player standing. Nice there. So it looks like Mala's gonna go for that 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 B knife just to see if there's any on mid. Up mid. They they notice that, but it looks like all of, of you know U of I is gonna be running it down mid. They're probably gonna default with the spike and then try to like push, push the space up. Not the 
I remember this game. I'm a little rusty on my arches or CT. It's whatever. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. But uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm a little rusty. On my yeah, we got a nice wall from Viper. When I split up sight, allow them to put entry. But it looks like Cypher on the other team is going to be holding the enemy line. Slow pushing up. They got the Vandal set up. Vandal's, of course, you know, best weapon over Phantom. We Is a defender sided map, I must admit. Yeah. The breeze after all the changes, they made it more you know, on the defender side to make it a bit more difficult to play around. Um, yeah, playing on one of their weaker maps, they've lost pistol round, they're not doing so great in their economy. Right yeah, we're, we're, it looks like we're playing eco this round pistols. However, it looks like Rain is going to force with the marshal right there. Could be a half buy out of that. Try to get some. Get, get at least one vandal out. Down. Got that talk Spike down, down mid. Oh, last like, player oh, standing. Lot of from us. Blood's the last one left. Flawless. Oh, there that is. The flawless coming out. To be fair, it wasn't eco gaming because you know we're on eco. It might have made it a bit, a little bit difficult uh, for us to you know, just get some picks out of there. It was classic versus vandals. It's an easy equation. Viper's gonna get the night set up wall on mid. You can see the all the way from mid. Looks like he's blocked off some areas with A as well. Gonna be nice there. Looks like it's a 2 3, or no, it's a, it's a 1 1 3 setup. Looks like Viper is gonna be mid, Cypher is gonna be mid, and then we got the 3 on A site. It's gonna be an interesting game though. Yeah, Cypher is just holding, you know, that, that B area, B hall by himself. Looks like he's just gonna hold that. Watch to make sure there's no enemy flanks on that. Kiwi's versus is really interesting thing to have a Kiwi here. But looks like they're running a B main. There is against one of us. Oh, great right there, making it a 4v3. Spraying to the smoke there, Viper. Poison's off. Toxins going up. Looks like Viper's working with mid there. Toxins nice green. pick there. Nice oh. pick blood too. Looking for that last what, one. one last oh, okay. Wait, 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 leave Spike the Kiwi down, here. B. Don't know that he's mid, but it looks like they're peeking B mid. 
Jets is holding B mid right there. It's gonna be crazy. Oh, she's I have she's retrieved the spike. Around. Kiwis <laughs> gets the head tap. That is a win for you, Idaho, right there. Ultimate Kiwi is with ready. a nice headshot from Kiwi. That that one tap. You that was a really impressive play. Okay. Looks like Kiwi's gonna go up. Set up A to make sure there's no anyone looking there. It's gonna be nice. Definitely needed that uh that win. Uh, put the trip down. Looks like they're splitting this time. They're gonna go A this time. However, you know, with the one one, or the the, the two three split uh, from Columbia, it's gonna be like an interesting way to play it around. Cause like while they won't have to deal with that cipher and the viper setup, they will have to deal with more opposition. This is gonna be really interesting to play around. Jack's gonna get that early two two nice. Try to get some info off of that. Jack holds down the two to run up. Jet looks like Jack's gonna back up off of that though. They're gonna take out as much space as possible. Looks like uh, you know Rainer. Oh, Rainer was taken down. Uh. close. 2v1. They don't know where he is, though, but they do have time to get that spike now. Looks like they're going to do that right now. Oh, well, they won. and it looks like a win. Sorry, we're having some technical <laughs> difficulties. We weren't able to see the game right there. Okay. You know Another win for us, moving. though. You know, we're coming forward. You know, we're getting some points out of here. We're getting, we're trying to learn how they play, learn how the to play style is. We're getting to know that they're, you know, getting that 2v. Rounds that they play, especially as they learn their opponents. Oh, you mean freeze? Freeze. You said freeze. I'm, I'm just all over the place. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Jet's gonna go peek so window. Similar. Gonna go for that jump peek thing because they have an op. They do have op money on the other team. Like something. Get hit by the cam though. I think they were able to take it down though, which is really quite fortunate for them. Ko popped his ult, which is gonna be difficult for them to push through. That it's gonna make it you know a bit more difficult. Will they push through it? Will they not push through it? It's just gonna create some tension there. Mm -hmm. Looks like there's only two on A now. Looks like the rest kind of rotated over. Are they gonna catch the Viper mid though? There's see there's a Viper lurking up mid, holding that angle right there. And they're just scared to peek her. They might see your gun right there. Silva, you know, is holding that angle. They're just trying to see if they can see that Viper. Looks like they're holding opposite sides of each other. Oh, Viper got that rain up out of the They got traded by Jacob Perkins. He takes him down mid with a nice spray there. Oh, they're backing up. Let's sort of push I know exactly. As much space as possible. We, get we might get this kind of jet. We see the jet on site. Our nice remaining. shot from J Jacob right there on jet. Perfect. Is leaving it to a 4v1. Will they find him? That is the question. They're holding all these angles here. Holding arches. They're holding mid. They're holding main. Are they going to be able to find the there. other cipher? Now, it's not impossible for us to lose this, but it's kind of unlikely. Looks like the cipher is going to go for the long wrap all the way to B main, but we do have our trip set up there. So in order for him to push through that, you know, it's going to be a little bit difficult there. That's, that is He's checking sure. those angles. He might be saving here. Spike's still ticking down slowly. He's got plenty of times if he just wants to run up and do it, but keep in mind he does have to kill the other mm. people. Cypher looks like he shot the trip. They kind of know where he is now. He's sitting there. Oh, they know where he is now. They're going to go for their quick wrap. They know out of time, though. They're going to run away, try to save their guns, make sure the Cypher isn't able to get any picks on them. Back up as quick as possible. And simple. No picks there. I wonder if this post game they're going to go looking for. Nope. <laughs> they bait him with the shorty. <laughs> But see, here's here's what we like to see, and here's here, it's like a normal pattern. They find that one game that they need, or they find that one round that they need, and they keep going and finding yeah. more opportunities to see uh, more rounds to take in. Yeah, the Vandals are they're quite unpredictable, and one of their their best strategies of how they play is they predict or they try to see how our, how the, their opponents play first, and then they they're just really good at adapting to the situations to play around them, play to the best of their ability, because. Mm. The pick, I think the agent picks might have been a bit difficult. The two duelists compared to the two, two initiators. Mm. They're, of course, going to have more information, especially defending. It's going to be nice and easy on them. Exactly. But on the other side, on the other half, you know, it's going to be a bit of an interesting game as well. Looks like we're going to be taking up space and B, cleared out with the drone, the Soviet drone. They see the Cypher mid, I think. They go up, they're trying to get some more information. They got nothing. They do have the wall there. However, Viper is blocking them off with this, with the, this smoke cloud there. 
you know, you don't typically want to push through cloud. Looks like they got a pick on us with the knives. Flash on us. Got those taps. Ending ahead. So a nice dart there. Clearing out, you know, all of Found the CT. Them. Trying to close that. Sees one. Gets a nice yeah. pick from Scorpion. Holds an angle, but gets traded by Mallow. We get another kill on by Jet. They're holding that angle. Oh, leaving it to a 3v1 on Jet. Are they going to be able to see it? He's being darted, though, which is a difficulty here. And oh. got shot down by Viper. Kind of pinched in that corner there. Yeah, with the pinch, with the with the Sova dart, the Viper uh, smoke up over. damaging him a little bit. He was kind of screwed there. Yeah. But he was able to get, you know, a few things before dying. So that was yeah. nice. He didn't yeah. go Killed down some of ego. That's true. In. Round nine, it's five three. CBC's favor. And we can see, you know, they have plenty of money. We're kind of lacking on money now. It looks like we're forcing as as much as possible. So I'm going like going oh, yeah. shields, making it a little bit difficult. That, you know, we might have the disadvantage here. However, if we just hold those angles right, hold those, you know, get those gunfights out of Eyes the way, up. it'll be easy. So it looks like we're actually going full shields instead. Right um, looks like we are like a little bit down in, in, in econ though. Jacob's gonna walk out mid, try to take up space. The flash from KO predicts it, though, dodges it. Oh, but Jacob the goes for the spray. Game. Yeah, it's the spray versus the tap. This is why you wanna tap with the Vandal. And unfortunately, had a hard way. Looks like we're gonna use our old map for some damage. Oh, looks like KO gets another one of us. Oh. Our jet. Another one, 3k. Down he a. Looks like he's going for that ace. He's overcooking a little bit, takes out, Last backs up, kills the fourth. Flawless. That is a flawless, not an ace, but that was a flawless from Go Columbia. Ace ace. Ace. Look at what they're doing. But you know, it, it goes to show not how, um, not only like how coordinated they are as a team, um, but just like how, I, I feel like more prepared they are for this game yeah. than we are. You know, we had, um, we had KO and Soba playing on A site. Uh, Soba doing a lot, using their util to kind of distract anyone who was hiding in hall, and KO just punishing yeah. anybody who was hiding in there. Definitely. Um, and then I mean, one thing worth noting, at the very beginning of the game, is that like we're on a map disadvantage. We're playing on a map that we that that we're way. not good at. We're purposely playing on a map. Try to give him a little bit of a head start. Looks like we're all running it down B main though. Looks like we're taking up some space mid, but that Viper wall is such a good wall from Columbia Base, and they have a really good setup on this map. They're not able to predict when they're rotating over. There's two tunnels, two there. They shoot the wall now, so those people in tunnels are gonna turn around, try to hold those angles on Jacob. Looks like they're gonna hold each other's crossfire. Sova drones out though, might get the tag on Reyna, yup. Viper peeked out though, so they both know that they're there. Looks like they're planning on B. Kiwi's getting that nice plant down, gonna throw it on a trap, try to get out of there. This is going to be a really interesting play. It's a 4v4. It's just how we're going to do it. Yeah, 3v4 right here. Looks like one's working up flank, though. Are they going to predict it, though? You see that? that we got, we got, you know, I think it's Sova working up flank. Might get that pick on Kiwi, though. Mm. They're not really looking at that. See, it's really dangerous about that angle. It's completely exposed to both window and anybody and flanking. And up, just exactly right there. What I'm Viper on. takes the pick. Viper gets the second. Jacob, oh, oh, yep. See, it's a really bad angle to be holding. Last player oh. Ending. Even then. Yeah, yeah, so I was able to get that to fuse. Unfortunate. Looks like he held it down, yeah. Now I'm wondering, like, I, I obviously can't speak for the rest of the team because I don't know how they play or whatever. Um, but I, I was wondering... Um, <laughs> yeah, we was, need... Uh, guys, we need some love for the from the Vandals. Yeah, can we get some love in the chat for the Vandals? I know we're saying let's go CBC, but come on. U of I, you know, we're pulling it out here. It is a 7-3. to three. <laughs> Half's almost <laughs> over. But it, to be fair, it's not our map. You know, it's well, not our map. And even then, like, I, uh, after speaking with Jacob before the game, he pretty much talked to me and he was like, this is practice. This is practice. This is a practice that's game, the point yeah. of a scrim. It's, it's, the point, it's, a night, it's time for both yeah. teams to, like, figure out what it is that they need to do. Yeah, I mean, it is a fun game, season. of course. It is It is just a for fun game, but it's still like your ego. That's what you're playing for. That's true. That Sova gets true. the damage on uh, on that Reyna there. Let's see if she's able to get some heal. The ult comes out, trying to kill that Reyna. Snake bite up from... Oh, oh big damage down. there on, on Cheese. Reyna gets a second snake bite off, but that means both of our snake bites are off. Sova's trying to get that another shock dart. Try to kill that Reyna. That shock dart would have killed if it would have landed. Mm -hmm. Looks like it's a 2v4. They're not going to waste that ult. Oh. And it looks like blood was taken down, but that nice I shots exactly there from Sova. We got the Cypher ult. Try to see where they are. We see that one's main. 
window and then one's arches. Second ping there. They're gonna peek out. The oh! Health disadvantage there, leaving it to a 1v1 from that nice trade on from Kiwi. Are they gonna see it happen? They don't have the spike. They are able to grab it if they're able to play this right. Nice right. shot there from Kiwi. That's a second clutch shot that we've seen from Kiwi. Absolutely. And honestly, I love to see it. Some good plays there. Kiwi is definitely uh, more of an underdog these days, you yeah. know? Yeah. Uh, holding some good rounds for the Vandals here. Getting those important shots where it counts the most. Death. Yeah, this is gonna be a this is gonna be a good game. <laughs> ah. Oh, I need to turn myself down a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. There we go. Yeah, we've seen some good plays from from UI Vico coming up. Look at the holding a main. Trying to get those get those lines of sight on the enemy. Sova's holding it. It looks like we're doing a 2-1-2 two, two split. Mm -hmm. Looks like we're holding down middle, trying to take up space. Are we going to see the Viper, though? The Viper keeps playing that angle there. Looks like we are. The Viper is able to take out our Reina. We do trade, though, on that Viper. Trade is, you know, it's okay if we trade. It's fine. Yeah, it's important. It's even interaction. Yeah, looks like we're going some Phantoms, some Vandals. Another trade just happened, leading to a... 3v3, uh, but, you know, they could always pick up that KO. KO's down right now. It's a 2v3. Looks like they aren't able to get, it, gonna get that KO up. There goes KO. Got that ult from Viper out. Try to take up some space. Another one. And the nice shots from Sova there. Those are some really good shots. We've seen some really good plays out of some of them. Some nice clutches. Honestly, just some really impressive plays. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. We're going up 7-5 now. Round 13. Yeah. Finally, into the second half, yep. where uh, CBC is playing uh, offense now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's gonna be a good play. We see this. Uh, that's a nice cipher trip. It's difficult to jump over. You hear someone jump over, you'll see it. And if they jump over, you tag them with that nice camera. There, it's a good setup from Kiwi. Looks like they're doing a similar thing. They have the the viper and the cipher on one site. Looks like Jacob's gonna peek mid, and they have the, another two on on A. Looks like Silver Mike play black back site. Try to get those darts off. It's going to be really interesting play here. They have a similar setup to CBC, but we'll okay. see how they're able to hold it. Yeah. Looks like it's also going to be, you know, B main plays. Usually most teams, they push B main. Mm. First round, that's like very typical, especially for Pestle. But, I mean, I'm, I'm hoping that the Vandals are going to be able to find the measure that they're looking for for this half. You know, like second half is a mental reset. Yeah, we see. We already saw a nice pick there from Jacob with that ghost down, uh, you know, mid. Mm. Able to take that one out. Looks like they're kind of backing up, trying to make them think they're rotating out CBC. Peaking mid, though, they got the Sova on mid as well, trying to get those predictions out for the mid push. They Three peeking out mid from us. They're rotating all the way hard to A. Viper's already on A, but looks like was taken out by Jet. Like I said, defender-sided map. Looks like through the three others, they're pushing up A main. They're going to try to take up some space as well. Jet's holding mid. They got the long mid push. Jet's going to peek that. Gets caught by the dart, though. She's the only one that they saw in sight, so they might just go oh! push her. Nice shot there from Jet. Oh, Second nice okay! shot from Jet. Oh, taken down, though. He was at low health, but that's still a three that's, kills from Jet. That is that really first impressive. first flick was amazing. Honestly. And then the second one through Pyramid. Oh. A good play from Sova there. Good pick. And got traded by our Sova. The Sova v. Sova diff. Good plays there from Absolutely. the Vandals. Absolutely. See, this is this is what I'm talking about. We find this. We find the next round. We're up. I'm knocking on wood. I don't want to jinx our... Yep. But we will be up. I, we, we I, believe, this, yeah. I believe in the pattern. We see it all the time. Um, I don't know. I'm, I, I guess now we have the god skinless yep. out of nowhere. Skinless is popping tens. off. He yeah, probably like we, just said, we said very at the very beginning of the stream, Skinless is a new addition to our varsity team, and we've seen some really good plays at him from Triad, some really good plays at him from here from him tonight. Some nice plays there. Here we are moving into round. Yeah, Viper actually is using the same Viper thing. It looks like we have four pushing up mid though. Gonna do it for uh, that jumping. Sees him there. He gets rushed by what the jet. Doing? Oh, oh. <laughs> Jet went for the for the knife and missed it. Looks like they're all going through mid. Two backing up through through main. Looks like they took out the ones who are going mid. It's a two v three though, so it could be still be anyone's game. They they do have we do have the numbers advantage, but you know we just have to see how it goes. We, I think we predicted that they're, that they're rotating out. Very risky plays from both teams here. here. They're holding that mid angle. We're trying to watch tunnels, trying to watch main, but it's kind of difficult to hold this B site. They're slowly starting to push up mid. We see this nice angle from Sova. Oh. Gets hit. Oh. Some nice damage out of both of them. Gets shot by Viper. 
Leaving it to a 2v2, trying to get that peek in. One nice! Ah. A backup from Lasered Cypher, killed by face. blood. Viper's <laughs> by herself, planting the spike on A. They do hear the sound, though. Rushing over spike to it. Planted. Not exactly where she planted. She's at 5 HP. This is going to be a really interesting play here. Nice oh, picks there. Good there trade, is. though. You know, like I said, the, the 5 HP is going to be difficult to play with. That was a good shot, though. Good play. I honestly would never play that angle in my games. Where? Maybe it works, where? though. Where? Is she able to find the spike? Yeah, I was okay, like, oh, where? I was looking for it, too. I was like, huh? <laughs> Giving that little head nod. Yep, it was mm. able to finally find the spike. Mm. Here we are, tied up once again. Now, even though... We oh, we see the nice Kiranami Sheriff, too. Even though we took that round, I would like to say... That I, I, I can appreciate like how like coordinated that CBC yeah. is. Um Duhun and Cypher knew to play off of each other. They were kind of peeking out back and forth, uh, trying not to let either of them get picked off right away. Yeah. Yes. Also, make sure you show your love in the chat. We have 18 people here right now. That's an impressive number from our usual streams. Good numbers, though. Make sure you're just giving those love and support in the chat for the Vandals. Looks like after we get some love in there, you know, they start popping off. So just keep that up. Keep going. We have some nice holds. It's a 2-1-2 split setup. Got the Sova on uh, A. You know, this nice setup. They're just waiting for the picks. They're playing off contact. The Viper Cypher setup on B is such a good setup. Mm -hmm. They're able to hold those angles. And they can just send it to everyone else, every place else. And it looks like they defaulted uh, CBC. They picked up the spike from B. They're trying to, they already predict there's some pressure there, trying to take up as much space as possible. Good cross hold. Yeah, they're holding the mid. Jacob looks like it looks like Jacob jump peeking mid though. Ko's gonna predict that he's there. Hold that angle. Trying to wait for that jump peek one more time. Jacob's gonna back up though, feeling all that pressure. Looks like they're peeking up, pushing up mid. There's three A main right now. They drone out. That drone might catch one of them. Nice shot there. Nice flick there on the drone. Not able to hit it though. Not able to connect. Oh. Nice. Oh, double shot from from the jet there, pushing up mid, taking down two of us. Jumps up, almost killed. Oh, down another player. Spike planted. It's leaving it to a 4v2. We are down in numbers, but like I said before, anything's possible. Get those snake bites out. Oh. Misses the, the, the transfer. Get Get spotted the by the cypher. It's going to be interesting. They're probably all going to push him right there. Kiwi not able to get those shots to connect. Just, it, just like Taken a poor down. angle to come in from. Even then... Yeah, you know they had they had side on lock. It was going to be really Honestly. hard to retake. And yeah, what what I also noticed is that as more of the vandals came on to site, or the ones that were getting picked off of site, they were coming two at a time. Two of them would be attacking at once. It was either um, PCUV uh, trying to distract them with Sova getting that guardian pick. Uh, I think on Scorpion yeah. there, um, and just like continuous oh, picks like that. That was what was allowing CBC to uh, control A like that. Unfortunate for the Vandals, obviously, but... Yeah, it looks like they're kind of switching gap. up the setups, too. We got Viper still throwing that cloud down. Nice wall there. And look at like the Cypher. Uh, Kiwi's going to put down her trap there in the middle. But it looks like they're going full A main push. Able to get that jet a little bit low, but not quite get her. Trying to dodge that arrow, though. Jacob's trying to make sure he can try to get out of there. Difficult angle to hold. He's making sure someone holds his back. Try to push forward. They might push out the... Yup. Oh. Pushed out. Double peek on Jacob. They did the flash. He tried to move away and then got taken down. We see the ult from... Uh, right there from Cypher. Oh my god. Nice shot. So still a 3v3. It is possible. Pulls out the shorty. The op shorty combo goes hard though. Nice start there. We might lose the op. Trying to go for that Vandal grab. Gets pushed. Gets one pick. Gets taken down from the long angle from mid, though. Okay, question for you and for everyone watching in the chat. Mm. What is the best bundle in Valorant? Best skin, best bundle. What do you think it is? Can't answer this. My honestly, answer is not well liked. Honestly, Kurunami bundle, it kind of goes hard. I do, I do like it a lot. Yeah. I, or I, Oni. I like Oni bundle. Woo! A classic. For what do, sure. Okay, what, what, do you, what do you think about Ion? 
I think it's overrated, yeah, except for Sheriff. I feel that. I Ion feel Sheriff that. is a great skin. I think every other skin in that bundle smite, is... Smite, I absolutely agree with you. Specifically, the Smite knife goes hard. They found my wire. My personal favorite is uh, the Black Market bundle. Yeah. That's what I Paying homage to its roots. What about the Wasteland Vandal? Oh, it looks like they're getting those picks in. That oh. Oh, I was only able to get one off of that, but to be fair, it looks like they're R on Eco, so it's going to be a bit difficult for them to play around this. Mm. Trying to get those picks. KO doesn't see the one mid. Guys, <laughs> those were the three body that shots. Vandal off KO. Cypher taking skinless. Nice plays there. Back A. It's a 2v3. They wait for that Cypher to be taken out. Okay, it's only Jacob on site. Another one gets those two picks. Gets uh, shot down by Jet. It's a 1v2. The spike is down though, so they are pressured by time. Trying to get those both in. Misses those share shots. Viper's gonna run up. Get that nice. nice shot there from Blood. Well played. There it is. That's what I like to see. Thrifty. Some of it might just be a mental diff. You know, I can tell CBC is taking their swings a lot more confidently. Yeah. They're just a lot more prepared to uh, go into certain fights that we aren't. Uh, yeah. And that's, you know, a, you know, it's very dangerous at times. I know, will I say could, that. Yeah, I could very easily see this game going to overtime. It is pretty close. It's been close pretty much the entire game. This could be anyone's game. Absolutely. Classic Vandal Slay. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly. Let him go. We're, we up. We up. Watch. We up. They're going for that A Gets push, that nice strip like. down, but they might hear that coming up. Tries to throw that trap down. Here's the footsteps. You know, of course, they are pushing B main. Look like they're defaulting, though. They did send some B to try to take up space, try to get through. They think it'll rotate in with that spike. Mm. You have a lot of CBC looking into Cave. Viper Interesting ult from in Viper. Cave try to make him, the rest of the maybe, team like, rotates. get some information off. Yeah, they are rotating with Spike there. K was able to predict. And look at that. It's working. Vandals are slowly rotating over. Blood gets that pick in mid. They see that the site is clear with KO pushing up. Rain is going on arches right there. They, they're doing a little peekaboo with each other. Mm. Trying to get those peeks out. Gets the ult out. Trying to predict that one cross. Get, Blood gets another pick right there off mid. Running out of arches. They see the, they see the Sova drone be main. They're going to push up. Viper's still mid. Nice pick there from Abandoned Scorpion. One enemy remaining. Nice pick, leaving it to a 5v1. We could flawless them right here as well. Flawless there right is. there. Vandal flawless. Blood taking a little bit of damage at the end there, but overall the Vandal's clutching it up. Honestly. Getting that nice round there. Tying it back up once again. Timeout. Looks like it's a Vandal timeout, actually. Huh. An interesting move, but I'm glad that we took this. Yeah. Um, we have a new coach uh, for this semester, Fane Luna, friend Fane Luna. of some cheeses, uh, here to help with timeouts, help with yep. recuperating in the game plans and stuff like that. Definitely appreciate it. Yeah, and I mean, the timeout definitely needed. This round's going to be super important. They see, you know, we're, we're on eco on the other team. We're full by on our team. We really need to take this next one to really push us forward. If we win this next one, they might force, you know, we could really kill their eco as much as possible. Try to take up as many rounds as possible before we get to round 12. Absolutely. Some very uh, high stakes going into yeah. this. These next few rounds are very, very important. So, uh, just in yeah, there's going to be a really interesting play. We could see anything happen here. 14 seconds left, and then, of course, we have the 20 until round starts. Mm. But, like I said, this is, could be anyone's game. I have high faith that this game is probably going to be going into overtime. But who knows? Like anything, we've already seen anything can happen. They went from a 7 to 2 to a 9 to 9. So, yeah. We see a nice trip there from, from Kiwi. Looks like that one's gonna one of those indestructible trips you hear of really hard to break. We're gonna see a nice cam setup. Looks might throw it to this. No, no, no. Nice. Okay, so that, that right there really good. You can tell when they're uh, planning. You can tell where they're going to plant, and when they're starting to plant, you can hit them with it, try to knock them off. We see an off the bat ult from Viper. Kale's gonna push through it though with his ult, stopping the Viper ult. Trying to use that molly. Yeah, trying to they get that pick Viper's on Viper. In that corner, but they don't know how deep. He's able to miss him. Oh! oh takes down one, takes down two, two takes down the three. What is nice. Going on? Is this going to be another flawless? We see a 3K already off the bat. Sumtis uh. is taken down by that rat corner from KO. KO still holding that main area. Viper isn't, Viper's doesn't know where he looking. is. They're pushing back, backing up, and this might be it. Oh, it takes down one of us. <laughs> <laughs> nice spray there. Shooting into nowhere. 
finding that final kill on uh, the KO. Bringing it up. 10-9. was a really good round. We've seen some Look really good plays. However, that was a double ult usage. It looks like that Kayla wasn't able to cancel out that Viper ult. Really well played, though, however. Absolutely. We see this, we see this same Cypher cool. setup. Looks like they're full running it down A with the spike. Or they might default. Kayla's, you know, doing the same thing, going B, trying to get some info out of there, trying to get bait some shots, maybe better rotate. For sure. Looks like he's going to peek mid, and then we have Viper. Or he's going to peek window, and then we have Viper mid. Try to take up space as we were doing the previous half. Take flight. Off the bat. Oh, spots two at least. Nice box shot though from C CBC. Kiwi trying to get that camera down as fast as possible. They're gonna shit fuck out of sight. Trying to make him think that they're leaving, you know. Less information we give CBC the better. Of course, of course. Looks like we're gonna wait a second on the dart, toss the dart forward, try to get some information out of this. I know exactly Old from Cypher though, so it's not really gonna give us much information. They wall up, but with that ult, they're able to see, spray through it. Very unfortunate. Looks like they're rotating out, though. They saw the pick mid. They're going to try to play off that as much as possible. Second pick mid, leaving it to a 2v5. We are at a severe numbers disadvantage. Absolutely. Looks like they're going to full run up mid. It's a blood five. They're going back to A through mid. They don't know where the enemy is, though. Sova's still holding mid. Are we going to see an ace from blood here? That's the question. I I don't know. Maybe I believe Cypher's Sova's holding half. A, yeah, and Sova's Get holding a, kind of a rat angle on mid. He's going to go for the peek. Is he going to see oh, the Sova, though? Oh, he's playing too loud. They don't know. No, looks like he's not going to see the oh. Sova. He's taken out from behind by that Sova. Wasn't able to clear that corner. Saw it coming from a mile away, but it doesn't hurt any less. Yup. Like I said, Breeze can be a lot more difficult to play around. Mm -hmm. Those nasty angles you can hide in, those nasty spots you can, you can camp in like a little rat. Those rat plays. Look at him. Do you believe? How do you how do you feel like these next few rounds are gonna go? Because we're 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 kind of at a stalemate right yeah. now. You know, we keep up trading one, rounds. up the other. It's, yeah, it's, yeah. You know, I think you're right. I think I think we will definitely be going in the OT. I just wonder how deep in the OT. Yeah, it looks like they might be going A here. They're taking the spike A at least. Mm. Off the dart back from Sova. They're gonna be backing off site. One of them is on A. Looks like you know Ko of course is trying to bait the. The pick again, trying to bait the uh, the rotate. Looks like they're rotating. Actually, looks like they're actually rotating out of there. They might predict that there's not as much heat on B, so they're going to be rotating over through spawn. Looks like they're going to go for the full rotate to B. Okay, trying to hold as much space there, B main as possible. But we do have three on B. This is going to be a really interesting way to play around this because they they're not predicting that we have all that heat on B. Mm -hmm. Slowly moving in through halls. You have Vipers backing up from B, trying to still watch mid though. Yep, going back to B to give off for some support. Jacob's saying, hey, there's no one here. Must be a B push. Communicating over. You can see Sova starting to peek mid, starting to push over. And they're starting to execute the KO knife. The op shot, though, from our jet. Trying to throw the snake bite, trying to stop the push. Looks like Viper's pushing up mid. Our Sova, though, might catch him there. Oh, looks oh. like Nocket runs with his gun out and gets oh. taken down by the Viper. That's the second time that someone hasn't checked their corners. 30 seconds left. 30 seconds left to plant, though. I don't want to be rude. They, have, they don't have anything else to do <laughs> but to rush down. Takes oh! oh! Oh, not able to get those headshots to connect, though. Looks like it's going to go right over. Misses that op shot. Spike Jacob's going to push forward mid. I Trying to get a couple exactly picks. That Sova dart, though, is going to be a little bit difficult to play around. And, of course, they have the Cypher ult. They're going to know exactly where they are. Second ping right there from Cypher's ult. Something she's thinking about leaving that or enemy Sova. My bad. Lots of S's going on today. <laughs> but looks like Jacob's gonna be pushing through. Take down one pick from Jacob. They're not gonna predict where the other two are though. Another oh, pick there. Last one's one. B main, but are they gonna see it? She's gonna peek out. They see her there. Yeah, Takes down yeah. the third. Are we gonna get the defuse out? Looks like we are gonna get it. Good play there from the Vandals. Absolutely. Damn skinless is Pretty good. Showing some skin. Um, I don't know where <laughs> I was going with that one. Little scandalous plays from Skinless. Absolutely. Some good performances. Skinless is taking off the skin of the... No, that sounds No, good. that <laughs> sounds gross. Oh, my God. Skinless is skinning the... No, okay, I'll just no. stop. I'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You know, you don't make it easy with a username like no, that. No, they don't. It no. goes here. Kiwi is putting citrus in the... I, uh, I don't know. <laughs> this is difficult. 
I remember that Summer was trying to think of uh, some cheese. Nice pick there from the off by skinless. It looks like we're also taking down Jacob. It's a 4v4 situation. They are pushing down A, but it looks like they might be rotating over. They see the heat. You know, they're going to rotate over try to because they're going to try to beat the rotate. However, it looks like we're able to predict that it might be a fake, and we go back to holding B. Really well played from the Vandals. Still holding those angles. Are we going to predict the one mid-doors? <laughs> Second is, time from Zaban and Scorpion walking this? with those knives out. I, he's distraught right now. Pick I from just Kiwi. know. He's yelling at himself over Gets there. Gets that drone that's He was uh, Blood's going to back up. Got that Cypher cam to see if they're going to push sight. So holding mid. Gets that shot off. Misses it. Gets oh. that one pick. Two oh. pick from Kiwi. Is Kiwi going to get a 4K? She's looking Seven for it. Seven bullets left. Oh, oh okay from Kiwi. The really good plays right there. The clean aim. Now it is 10 to 12. We win this next one. We win game one. Absolutely. That we could see something really incredible here. But I'm also nervous because this is where the energy starts to shift. Because we can also see CBC pick up whatever energy they dropped off a few rounds ago. Bring it in a OT. However, I think we have something that CBC does not. Skinless? No, we <laughs> we have fist bumps. In case you don't know, you viewers, every single time the Vandals play around, they give each other fist bumps. Really? Yeah. Really? Try to keep the morale up. Yeah, they, they give each other fist bumps, high fives, whatever, to keep the, the morale up as high as possible. Hell yeah. Look, like they're running that. up mid. They're trying to get back up. They, they're predicting a B push. They're full on running it up mid, taking up as much space. They're holding one, you know, that B hauls right there. Trying to push that tunnels area. Watching those angles. Here comes the op. However, Jet's going to push up. She's going to... Oh, the one. finding the wrong... She does have the shorty, but it looks like, you know, the other Jet's able to spray through the smoke. I don't think they were see one the Nice shot through. there. there and that is. is a win for Vandals. A Vandal quick win. quick round. Finishing G's off everyone. that first game. That was that, a great game. I wasn't expecting them to actually turn it around like that. Yeah, that, that was ring. really impressive. We saw some really impressive plays out of them. Honestly, I haven't seen anything that good in that long. You see, you know, we might not be the highest on the scoreboard, but we still were able to win. Some cheese actually bottom fragging his For team. For the first time. It was actually funny. Some cheese and I were joking before the game starts. I was like, yeah, on stream I'll just say you're silver. But it looks like I might have to <laughs> have. <laughs> yeah, we, we saw some uh, excellently balanced gameplay today. Yeah. CBC definitely bringing some uh, heat to the table. Yeah, and I mean, maybe the not 10 to expected. 13. 10 to 13. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. It's not like we, we totally wiped the floor like we have with other colleges, but it was pretty close. Wouldn't it be the first team that we 13 uh, to? <laughs> I'm not saying any names, but uh, it's a familiar number to see on the screen here. Yeah. I did see some talking in chat. We are going on a quick three minute break, and yeah. then we will be right back. Yeah, we'll with be right back. Game two. Yeah. I, I don't know. I think CBC will be picking the next map, so I wonder how things are going to be going for this next game here. Yeah, we'll have to see, we'll have to see. We'll have to see indeed. Well, uh, so come here often or? <laughs> <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Are you ready? Get ready, y'all. Get ready. Get ready. This be the green light. Go. Ties burn the pavement. People want to know where Mace Poss and Dave went. Still here, still in your ear with a style so hot. You'll see where all the sun rage went. Legs on the head. In a frenzy, the blends be all the right cred, meaning credentials. Best of both worlds when we rockin' over pearls in the instrumental. Are you ready? Like rocket fuel.
KJ can kind of be intertwined with Cypher, KJ, maybe some others, but KJ is also a really good pick on this map. We've seen some good plays out of Scorpion on KJ on this map. Absolutely. So, looks like, like a pretty good else. team comp. How, and how actually, if you look at the other team, it's pretty much the exact same thing. They went there for, they went for a Viper instead of a Breach, but they've got the KJ, got the Sky, got the Omen, like I said, the Omen of the Astros needed. It's going to be a really good game here. Absolutely. I just like uh, seeing like all the different agents and thinking about how versatile they are. Especially KJ, you know, can be played at almost any spite, any site, especially C and A. Yeah. Have some great setups for uh, both of those sites. Um, Omen, a, a very reliable controller. Yeah. I'm yeah. I I think we have some very even competition on both sides here. Very uh, excited to see how things are going to turn out. Yeah, honestly. And I don't know about you. Typically, when I play Lotus, I play Omen. I'm a hard Omen, man. I play too much Omen. <laughs> Typically, the smart Omen play here, and it looks like they might be going for it too, is you play on B or the C area. It allows you to smoke off either side really quick, really simple. Yeah, looks like he's going to be holding that B. Looks like he's going to go for the hard B push, or the C push there. Going to go straight into mound. Looks like we're going to go for a, a one, or maybe, no, a two, three split. Looks like let the turret watch B, the nice KJ setup on C. Because, of course, you have to stay in range of the turret. That's what makes it a little bit difficult to play KJ while she is playable on any site. So, we see some good plays there. The nice three push. Looks like they are going for the nade, the flash, the viper snake bite pick off A. That's usually what the play is here. They wait for the nade, though. They see the flash. There's the nade. There's the snake bite. Another flash. They're pushing up as fast as possible. There goes the Astro smoke, though. Interesting to play good so Good picks there. We've already a trade. On defense. We're down to... Last good picks up from both. They try to run back. Oh the my nade God. gets them. And looks like we were just taken out so quick. They were very Like I said, very the impatient. raise play on defense is such a good idea. That's true. You Especially can do so a, much that with that raid. That is super reliable. Yeah. Now, and we can see it. Look, again, boom, the Rays running it down A. <laughs> you always send that. See, you, I don't think you will ever see a Lotus play where the Rays is not on A. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. They're always over there. Yeah, we're going for a 1 2 2 defense. split, though. We're predicting the B push. Looks like we're sneaking up through B right now. Waiting for the contact. The turret's able to spot us, so we try to take it down. But it looks like they have a marshal, though. They're just spraying for the smoke, trying to get some picks off. He's going for the nade. Tosses the nade up, trying to get that da damage in. Looks like he's able to get a little bit, not a lot. Looks like we traded already off the bat. We're down health, which is not great, mm. but it is winnable. We got the, the sky able to give us a little bit of heals, though. I got this spot. Take the spike. Are they gonna predict the the, the the plays though? Hey, it looks like they have a they might have a vandal. Looks like they just quickly shot down that that dog there. Spike they have an Ares. B. Pushing up, trying to get that classic kill. Two Whoa. classic kills and the stinger kill right there. It's a 3v2. We are down very low in health. Don't have a sky anymore. We're just holding those angles. Takes down our scorpion. I know those angles. Both of us, 10 HP, 5 HP. We're very, very low. Final hold. Takes that down. We still have the Vandal, though. Sky pushes up, flashes, back it up. Oh, and with the 2 HP right there, we're not able to quite get that pick. Gonna go grab that Vandal, of course. Can't forget about that. I just, I blame it on yeah, the Bulldog diff. 1 HP, it looks like. Blame it on the Bulldog diff. Oh, always the Bulldog. People... Undermining its ability. Look yeah. at him. Look at him go. Took out the last two. Right. Looks like he's got. Spike. Dude, this, this right here, man of taste. We got the black Kuronami Vandal. Everyone hates on it, the black and the red, but I love it. I think it looks great. Looks like we are going to be buying here. We're going to be forcing here. Gonna go for like a, looks like a default. No, 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 it looks like we're not gonna default. We're gonna go one mid, one C, the rest A. They're gonna go for that Raisinate again, so they gotta be careful. They wait, played time, got the Sky Flash on A. It's really slow play here.
waiting for that contact. They're all holding these angles, trying to push up. Looks like KJ's trying to push up as much as possible. Omen's just chilling there on C site. Yeah, that looks like they are defaulting. They didn't need the spike there. Omen, of course, fast smokes. Looks like B lane. Coming back. Pulling that red angle. TP is across his Looks like Raze might have heard it though. They're backing up. Trying to get that support over. They predicting that, you know, Vandals are running over to C, so they have that KJ pushed up as well onto site. The Omen already on site. Looks like they're sending over the Raze and the Viper right now. Trying to make sure B is clear. They see that it's smoked, but you know, could be some pressure here. They're pushing the wall though, trying to make him, you know, lose that information. They keep just kind of hold that omen. Omen's just, oh, got the omen though. Really good play off the bat. Raze rushing into side, trying to get those picks. Sees the raise there, shoots the boom bot. Flashback going out, gets that pick on Raze. Looks like it's a 2v5 right now. We're able to get as much information, as much picks as possible. We've tried to trick him into thinking we were right hitting through B. So they sent, they kept Viper and Sky there. So we kind, they kind of lost some information with a bit of confusion there. Hmm. Sky dogs in, sees no one. Holding those angles. Viper's pushing up. Might see some interesting plays out here. Sky flashes, see if anyone's gonna come on their flank there in CT. Raise backs up, they predict they're both waterfall. One Viper gets remaining. one pick, they trade, and they nice eight. pick from Kiwi there on the Viper. The so it looks like Dohyan, I think is like, Hyun, I'm not 100% sure, but it looks like there might be a Viper, maybe we've ever seen two really good Viper setups from them. You know, last map, this map. So mm -hmm. we've seen some really interesting plays from them. Thanks. I'm excited to see what happens next year if they uh, decide to join the Vandal team. Yeah. We found that third round, found that force, uh, or some success from that force round yeah. that we were looking for. It's going to contribute heavily to the success of these future rounds here. Yeah, uh, for sure. If we're able to capitalize on there. that bonus anyway. It looks like we're going to be defaulting again. You want to fight They're pushing it. up. The Astro Wall goes out, trying to, you know, get them to lose some information. Looks yeah. like it's working though. They're able to run over. They're taking the spike A, but everyone is just full running it down to C. Sky's holding A long with on the stairs right there with the Astro smoke. They might predict there. the smoke there. Looks like Viper has a wall on, on, on uh, A to cut up the contact. They see the Sky, try to get her. I'm not able to get her. But sky Flash comes out, and tries to stop the push. They're pushing downstairs. Here comes the Boom Bot. They take down the Boom Bot, of course. Bomb goes on the side. They might be rotating to B here. Trying to fake the rotate as well. Looks like they do have Spike on B though. They're planning on B. They take out that KJ there. KJ on KJ. See, Breach is really good on this map. Trying to like split up those angles, put the side for concussions. A trade there from Kiwi. They know there's two there. Kiwi going back out. Sees the heal from the sky. It gets that one on Sky. They know there's one more there. Looks like Viper is able to win that gun battle, though. They're holding that weird long angle there. Backs up. Still gets the pick, though. Nice 2K from Skinless there. Finishing it off in a weird corner, but figuring it out. It works. Succeeding nonetheless. I, 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 I bet it against it. I shouldn't have done that. I'm, uh, I'm expecting the uh, kind of eco ruination now. Yeah. Uh, I'm... Yeah, now I can see it. Um, CBC not doing too great in terms of their economy over there. Yeah, it looks like they're saving this round, which is the smart play, of course. Mm. Some of them appear to be buying shares, but, you know, if, if you can still buy next round, I guess it doesn't really matter all too much. You're trying to get as much kills, as much uh, money off of your shares as possible. Jump peek, see long, sees them there. Bless you. They're holding that A site. They might see that A is clear. The best thing to do when you're e on eco is you want to group together as much as possible. If you of group course. together, your one guns all together becomes pretty much a vandal. Five sheriffs is basically a vandal. But they see that A is clear. Raze is rushing over onto site. They're waiting for that door to open, it looks like. Just holding that angle. They see the rotate. They're rotating to B. Are they gonna, is Skinless gonna see them though? Viper wall going up. Turret spots him. He's going to back up, though. Just try to, you know, ruin their information. We see Astra full smoking off a site, predicting that they're going to be coming from that way, from CT. They're pushing up. They're going through Link. Skinless just holding this long angle, hoping they don't suspect him there. 
Dogging though, they did see him. They're gonna flash though. Nice pick there from Riz. Good pick there as well, leaving it to a 4v or 3v1 now. Looks like Viper was able to get that skinless. It's long age battle running with the knives out though. That is not a smart idea. We've already saw that from the last game on Breeze. You do not run with your knives out. Mm -hmm. Abandoned Scorpion had to learn the lesson, what, two, three times? I think we saw it almost five. But yeah. Dog, it was brutal for him. I feel bad. <laughs> Seems like we CBC see a timeout from taking, CDC, yeah. Yeah, finding that lose streak over there, it's uh, definitely ruining some mental, I'm sure. And there. finding that, uh, taking some time to reset, figure out what, there. where they need to pivot, definitely important. There. Yeah. There. There. Amelia did that a lot. It's there. Fun. There. Amelia did it a lot. That's funny. Yeah. Just be overly harsh. There. Why not? There. Yeah. You'll see. You'll see. Now the camera's right. back on me. I don't even have my mic on, man. You have any? You have anything to say? No, I, don't, I don't know why we're on camera. <laughs> I don't. I didn't see really a reason to switch to us. I don't know. Nothing else is going on, right? All right, timeout is over. They're gonna be pushing up through C main. <laughs> try to take mound. Omen's gonna, of course, hard push that mound angle. Gonna try to get a pick off off the bat. Try to get up as much information as possible. Mm. <laughs> That one-way smoke from Omen right there. It's a nice smoke. It looks like Vandal just push right through it. They don't even care. The aftershock coming out. Ray's going to go oh. in. The oh. nice play from oh. Okay, okay. There, there it is. Cheese. Going to nade that waterfall. Try to get them to back up. Trying to get as much space taken as possible. The more space you have, of course, the better you're going to do. Of course. That nice pick there. Oh. Oh. He's with one with his <laughs> nice out. He, he gets so eager. I get the one kill. I'm like, yep, that's it. That's that's yep. the round for me. Honestly, I got my one. It don't matter. They see, oh, oh, looks like they traded there. The 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 Mado Kiwi trade off. Mm. They don't know where the Viper is. Blood is like one HP. This could be Last anyone. Nice kill there from Viper. But some cheese is Spike playing at a good down. angle where Viper is vulnerable. Also playing at about half. Viper's gonna there. smoke it and then go for the push. Nice there kill there from Jacob. Honestly, I get what you're saying. He keeps just <laughs> taking his knives out. He's just bouncing around. Look, I respect listen, listen, he gets I get his it. one. He, he has he nice out. knives. Uh, he has nice knives. He wants to show them off. He spent a lot of money on those <laughs> knives. I get it. However, we don't need to see them every two minutes. You know what? Listen, I thought running with your knives out was a problem for low elo, not, you know, whatever elo he is. There. What is... I think Scorpion is ascended or immortal. No, I think ascended. Yeah, I I would believe ascended. Ascended or diamond? Nah, I think ascended. Yeah. Nice flash there. Counter flash. The boom bot. Ray's trying to jump away. Throw the nade. Backside rubble. Get the kill. They trade. Trying the to play off. Nice. Oh, oh, they have a. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh hello. Nice pick there. Looks like Kiwi ran. Or, uh, Jacob ran out of ammo there. That was really interesting. He's Diamond 3. So that's basically Ascended, right? <laughs> well, it depends on like how high Elo he is, I think. Yeah, how high They're IRR. too pretty. He's too tempted. That's so true. He loves them so much. He gets a kill and then wants to show off his knives. Uh, I mean, fair, I guess. They're pretty knives. They're pushing. I do uh, like, like CD, the yeah, CDC's pushing upstairs. They, they're going to predict that, though. Breach turns his back. Well, He's holding the lock. Nice kill from Scorpion. Is he going to take his knives out, though? That's the question. Is Scorpion going to take his knives out? No, D3 is basically like... Scorpion at backing that one, up that? the tree. My, my think that their flanks are going to hold that angle just in case. Some cheese coming up. <laughs> <laughs> nice kill there from honestly should have went through the knife. Yeah, should have went for the knife. Of course, uh, uh, maybe Scorpion. Been too Scorpion would have went for the knife there. Of course, <laughs> he has to show everything. Diamond three is basically immortal. Immortal is basically radiant. Honestly, yeah. So yeah. all yeah. of our team pretty much radiant. We pretty much have a Premier League team here. They're radiant by heart. Spiritually, we're all. We radiant. got the radiant aim, the silver <laughs> gameplay. <laughs> 
There. So you, you you see a lot of the same stuff, you know, going uh even into yeah. those higher elos. You yeah. see a lot of the same mistakes. We're only human. Looks like they're hard putting down the nice flash. They're turning his back completely, trying to play that counter flash. Another flash there from Sky, the boom bot, the turret, the aftershock, the concuss, the nade, all of utils being dumped here. Looks like we're shocking mound there, trying to get at least some damage. He Backside, one tap, gets a kill, trades Strike off. It's a 3v4. Scorpion We're holding this one. angle, not taking his if knives If Scorpion out. gets his kill and takes his knives out, I swear. He <laughs> takes his knives out! <laughs> I called it, I called uh, it. It's every time, man. Nice oh. kill there from Jacob. That was a, basically a one tap. Will they see the KJ? <laughs> the flash on KJ, he knows he's there. Oh. Gets killed by the KJ, though. Scorpion walking with his knives out. <laughs> He loves him. He loves him so much. I love that for him. Spring Skinless like almost just damage. Nice damage it. from Scorpion, of course. Yeah. Takes the knives out. Yeah. <laughs> he just isn't capable of That's keeping his gun out. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like, oh, it's too ugly. I don't want to see it. I mean, get look, it off look at that screen. animation. Though. Can we can we get that animation one more time? Look at that animation on Scorpion's knives. That is so good. Look at the. Is that the? I think that's the, the Valorant go. Yup. Valonko, uh, oh, what is that kind of knife called? I think it's a kick. It starts with a K, I think. It's not the Karambit. Kar no. no. No, because that's the, the like, curve. Karambit's the butterfly knife. Yeah. I, I'm going to think of it at some point. It's just going to randomly pop it's it. It's a jet knife. In the middle of stream. It's a jet knife. Whatever it's called. Fire Thank you. Oh, raise. It's called the Yeah, see, I knew it started with a K. Hey. Out of Interesting sprays there from Jacob. I mean, you want to clear those angles, of course. This area right here is just a difficult area to play around. Some she's having to play careful. Oh, looks away looks for away just the worst a second. Minute. All right, looks like they might be playing counter plan. We do have that spike down. Yeah, we have the Viper ult. We have the Sky ult if we really need it. They're holding those angles. Sky Dog comes out. He's going to go see the Sky there. Nice flash there on the KJ. Not going to play off of it, though. Really interesting. We see the ult come out, the spray through really the walls. Really weird time. Even if they take it, I don't think they'll have time to Interesting plays. They're trying for it. Will, Will they get they the, I think it? they'll yeah, get I think, the defuse. Yeah, they're going to find it. Yeah. Yeah. Really interesting plays from the Vandals here tonight. Yeah, I wasn't expecting the ult play like that. Yeah, I mean, it was a really good play from CDC. The nice ult there. We weren't able, uh, they were able to capitalize off the ult. We just weren't able to stop it. They came out, they ulted, they flashed. They knew where we all were. We were all just playing mound. Not a good play to all play mound. I think we were all playing too off. We kind of just let them into yeah, sight. and gave that them did not, sight. Yeah, and that did not yeah. play yeah, in Vandals our favor had to at all. Just give them that one round. Honestly, yeah. You know, you know we just had to go easy. Just be nice. Yeah. yeah. We come back. We come back from these. Because if, we, if we're too come mean. Back as we're here's the thing, six, right? three. If we're too mean, <laughs> CDC will, will FF, yeah. right? We don't want that to happen. Of course. Yeah. So we have, we gotta give him a couple. You want to fight it? I would like to see CDC at that though. That'd be kind of funny. Yeah. We've only had one actual like in nice kill game. from some cheese there. So we've got the ult coming out from CDC on Omen. The looks like we got that ult from Ki Kiwi as well. Kill from KJ. Unsuspecting behind that Viper Double kill wall. on us, though, leaving it to a 3v3. Looks like we have Spike. It's close to sight. We're trying to back off with it, though. We try to collect as much space. They might, no, they didn't see the rotate, though. The dog didn't realize it, but they might just hear it, you know. They're still, you know, still sitting on A site. Astro's trying to take up as much space as possible, CT. I'm trying to see if we can get a pick there. Will they see the Viper on B, though? That's the question. That might be a really good play. Here comes the Sky. Scorpion might try to capitalize on that spot there. Sky pushing out. It's blood. Here's him coming. Shift walking up. Are they going to catch each other? No, it looks like Sky's going B. Blood's going to still hold that angle, though. See the Omen coming around that corner. Gets peeked by both of them. Scorpion comes out. Gets double peeked again. Leaving it to a 2v1. She's sky coming out the flash on them. They know kind of where she is, not 100%. See her there. Oh, and it looks like Skinless is taken down. 
Honestly, same situation. Should have played closer to Spike. Instead, we sent all of our people running off to the moon. Makes it very difficult for us to hold the site Before when we're not at the site. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think at this point, you know, two times failures at sea. I think we're going to start figuring out what's going on and yeah, yeah. hopefully so fixing I our think strategy. I, I'm not a professional Valorant player, mm. but I think after you plant the spike, you're supposed to protect it. Yeah, right. just a thought, Which maybe. Which is something we're not really seeing all too much, though, from the Vandals. Surprisingly, we think that they'd know that. But it looks like they're running away. They're just trying to get kills, honestly. I think that's the problem. They're, they're yep. running away, trying to capitalize on the kills, trying to get as much space as possible. They predicted that, you know, there's no one close to sight. They tried to spread out, get the kills. So. But, you know, CBC, we've seen CBC do that themselves before. That's true. And maybe we were just hoping it would work for us as well. Vandals are pros in my heart. I feel that, yeah. <laughs> Okay, let's oh, we will have out. some cheese. Will we see the omen there? That's the question. We see the, might see the tip of the gun. Imagined. Don't see the tip of the gun. Is omen going to capitalize on this play? We might think there's Just. someone there. Ass is going to oh. pick. See him there. Nice there kill is. on the omen. Going to push out. Get a second kill. 5v2. Oh, 3v1. Oh, what the? A nice Don't 4k heal. from Viper. Molo stealing that ace. What are you doing, man? Jesus! That was a round and a half. In the half. They just lined up for him. That 4K, they lined up perfectly for the Viper. Viper literally just tapped. Viper showing us how to play Aiden Labs, honestly. <laughs> We're moving into round 12. Almost at that half. Almost at the half. Still in the Vandal's favor, but only by one point. Yeah. And a 7-5 half would be nice. 6-6. Six, six. Mm -hmm. That's all right. We still seven, five, uh, seven, five in Vandal's favor this time. Yeah. Yeah. They're just going to look right at the flag. Might think it's fake. And a wait for it to pop, of course. They're kind of lining up down. again. They <laughs> get Spike picked down oh. by the Viper. This is going to be another 4K situation. They flash out. Sumchi is just holding that angle. Ray's might push CBC through that. Trying to push forward. Sky coming out. Ray's with the ult. They're going to try to get it off. Not able to get uh, any kills there. He tried to go for the transfer. Didn't know exactly who to hold. The aim on, making it a bit difficult. Mm. We do see some They're cheese. watching, making sure there's no one coming rotate. Watch it be. Oh, missed the kill on the KJ. I think they're, they're like, they're mental. I think it's what's up. Maybe. Yeah. We can see they're starting to miss more kills. Their mental is just all over the place. Mm. KJ we'll is a couple just, rounds will KJ do is that too. there by herself mid. It's not really a good spot to hold mid if you're by yourself trying to get that one on four. Because they could be anywhere. When you're in that mid area right there before B, it's so difficult to try to play around. We see KJ take out Omen though. Oh, but not able to get the right headshot on the Viper. Switching sides. Man, we've seen some really, really good plays here tonight. 6-6, six, six, good half. Like I said, 7-5 in favor of, in the, of the Vandals would have been preferred, but a 6-6, six, six, it's all right. It happens sometimes. Good half means that we're pretty even. This one could actually go into OT. Of course. I... I, I would believe it. I could see it happen. Especially yeah. Lotus. I know that the Vandals are a bit better with Lotus, a bit more comfortable. Yeah. We've seen some Something I want to note real quick. Really interestingly, it, oh, no, maybe I might be wrong, but it looked like Raze wasn't going to play on B. But like I said, you always throw the nade <laughs> down A main. It's like tradition. Flash, the aftershock, the nade. Looks like we're not able to get any damage off of it, though. They flash us back, trying to get that counter. Probably for the better, though. Yeah. Rest yeah, we got to go on that win streak, get that V off. Going straight in to B, immediately trying to get that spike down. Honestly, right yeah, we get that spike down from the CBC. Spike Vandals planted. are spraying through the smoke. Nice pick from Scorpion there. Not taking his knives out. Honestly, surprise, <laughs> he's learning. Double kill there from Mallow, the nade and the Whoa. gun. Nice shot there from, from Cheese. It's a 3v2. Get, oh, Last all right. Lag issue, lag issue. That, lag that issue. had yeah. to be lag. Yeah, no. Had to be lag. Saw, saw a lag spike. Lag, lag spike, spike in Lag action. spike there from mm. Cheese. You know, just wasn't able to get that nice headshot on the Omen. 
Yeah, so look, as I, as I said before, you're going to run the Rays all day. And the really interesting thing about Vandals yeah. do is they they love the Breach Rays play. Mm -hmm. If they get stunned, they get flashed, they get naded, instant kill. Mm -hmm. And it looks like they might all be going a main. It's a 2-3 split. They yeah. could be defaulting as well. Looks like Cage is going to back up to mid. Yeah, looks like they're going to go for a default here. Omen's going to play. They're going to play off contact. Not going to flash yet. Not going to nade yet. And slowly Wait moving towards noise. C, maybe? Yeah, I mean, Omen know, and of course, Razor the benefit of a default is you're going to try to take up as much space as possible in as many areas as possible. Mm. Going to throw that nade out. They know that they're coming. Raze is going off B, though. Mm. Now they're not able to do that raise nade. They, they might start here to push up. They see the door coming. They're going to get ready for that flash there. Throws a flash. Sees the KJ. Able to oh, get a little KJ bit on still there. on their back. Oh, double Molo kill down. Jeez, pushing upstairs. Gets popped by the alarm bot. Spike planted. It's going to be really interesting. Really difficult here. As well as we're on eco. Jeez, with those long range classic shots. You get a lot of damage off, but that double kill off the sheriff right there from the Viper. You know, we are on eco. It's going to be difficult. Of course. Yeah, yeah it's only flowers. second round. See, now it's bad. We were on, you know, we were on eco right there, We, but we could have at least tried to get one. And the downside of not getting one well, is their econ is just going to be even higher. It wasn't really even eco more than we weren't expecting CBC to force like that. That is true, yeah. You know, they second, just bought full was that, second, second round. Yeah, full second round. Yeah. Well, I, I don't think that we were ready for that play. That's true. However, it did, you know, you know. C we have some more money CB now. Yeah, however, CBC was able to capitalize on that because they did mm -hmm. buy go for the Vandals, yes, but none of them lost them. Touch That's true. Out. That is true. Looks like they're going for a 4-1 split. Coming mound. We're holding kind of backside C. Just playing off a KJ util right there. KJ is just waiting for the alarm by noise. We got blood pushing out B. Just holding those angles. It looks like CBC might be coming B, actually. They might have noticed all the KJ util. The very quiet. Probably predicted that KJ was holding that site. We see some really interesting plays here. CBC trying to play off some contact on B. Just kind of, you know, waiting to see someone first. Omen taking up as much space as possible, trying to capitalize on that. And it's kind of working. You see, you see CBC coming over to A off of Omen. Omen smoke stairs. They might execute right here. Breach getting ready with his util. Sends the concussion. Forward. However, the Astro Smoke, the Viper Wall, is going to be difficult to capitalize off it. They broke the wall to B. They looks like they're running towards B. Spray through the smoke there. Not able to get anyone. Getting into a 3v3 situation. Left. Getting that plant down. Spike planted. The rest of the Vandals slowly circling in on B. Some of the CPC stuffing off. Yeah. Dogs down from skin. Trying to get some, some sort of information. Ah. 3v2. 3v1. Oh. Three. Picked oh. off in every separate Nine corner. Six. That was a full execute. And we see, you know, Viper with those Kiranami knives. <laughs> Okay, one peeve about the Kiranami knives. Really good skin. They look really good for yourself. Every, it's really weird because when you look at the Kiranami knives from like someone else's perspective, it's just one knife. It upsets me so much. <laughs> See some interesting plays here. It's a 2-1-2 two, two setup. Looks like they might run it down B or default. They usually send the KJ mid to default. Taking up space C. Omen's just sitting there on A, trying to bait that nade, that flash, I'm guessing. Backing up. Ray's pushing towards site, destroying the turret, trying to get as much, you know, util out of that. Smoke down. Just kind of back up, because, of course, you don't push through the smoke. Backing up to, you know, their spawn. There's going to be really interesting players. It's going to be really interesting to see what they do. Playing off Jeez. contact. Jeez. Jeez. Him you there. saw him. You saw him. You're gone. 
I'm just trying to hold those angles, it looks like. The gunfights for some of our vandals might be a little bit difficult here. We have that econ disadvantage. Oh! Nice kill for there from Blood. They trying might to try to away. run up, get that kill for though. Blood trying to get out of there as, as fast as possible. <sighs> Would Scott be able to heal through that wall? Spike planted. Uh, no, no. I see. Four to four situation here. Kiwi just trying to get that crosshair lined up, trying to get that pick. It looks like she's been sprayed by a classic. Raise there with the oh. bolt, though, getting Kiwi down. Not a good angle for Blitz to be playing with the stinger. Or v one and that, then the win be C B C. Mm. Ten six now. Sure C B C favor. So about that overtime we were talking yeah. about earlier. I don't know. I'm wondering if they're gonna take a timeout at all because That's I don't what I'm think yeah. they have. And no. that loss streak is it's pretty hard. Yeah, and I mean, I think what it all comes down to Here. is it's just like a mental thing. Mm -hmm. I think, like I said, you know, after every single round, they do do the little fist bump thing. However, you know, that many rounds lost, of course your mental is going to start to tank. Mm -hmm. And mental is everything. Mm -hmm. Looks like they're going to go full yeah. A. They're not expecting a raise there. They're just going to start pushing out. The sky isn't there. The raise isn't there. They're just getting a full sight free, basically. Pushing out, trying to get as much information. Omen smoke stairs. Breach getting ready. I've with got his your tremor. Tremor goes for it. Send. Try to get the action. Sends it, but misses it. Tries to get that flash. Flashes out of the sight. Oh. oh! Oh! Gets the Still viper. That However, it's anyway, traded by the AJ. Spike planted. Yeah, Vandals are gonna win this, I believe. Oh, oh so bad play. really bad corner right on that molly. Yeah, I couldn't really push out and jump there. I was been killed. I couldn't really run without taking even more damage. Spike is ready at the flash for Raze. Will they predict that one is on site? One Gets the trade on Omen. They know that one's tree. They just need to get this defuse. They're gonna hold that, hold the angle. Last player oh! Are they gonna stick They're it? They're gonna That's get it! it. Ah! They stick the spike! Into defuse. Hey, hey, bros don't fake. Bros don't fake. Bros don't fake. We see the knives again from Scorpion. Of course we see the knives from Scorpion. It's a celebratory and move We did now. see at the very end, you know, Killjoy was able to kill Killjoy, which allowed us to kind of screw up their eco here. Mm. If we are able to get, you know, some of those kills off, we're able to, and as you can see, it's kind of working. Some of them aren't able to do full buys. It's going to be helpful for us. Oh, look at Dalyan over there. 28 and 9. <laughs> yeah. Terrifying like they have, they predator over there. It looks like actually we're the ones that aren't able to buy. We're down. We have to save this round. We were well, able to get a little bit of their eco offset. The past though. few rounds have been a little tough. I think we had to play off of their yeah. weapons. Yep. Getting better at the eco. One away from the ult from Cheese. Playing with their classic. Probably at too long of an angle. They don't know that. They're going to have to be nice ult there from Kelly. Yeah, that ult is really good because it's really hard to counteract. However, you can counteract it with your own ult, I guess. Just negates both of them. Viper ult on A, trying to stop them from pushing there as well. Basically Blood giving them another more long side. angles with the stinger. Good kill there from Viper on Blood. Spike planted. Skinless trying to you know, shift shift up into sight, trying to get that Viper down. Ooh. Nice shot there from Skinless. Going to throw the bird out. Not able to capitalize on it. It's a 3v1. Not impossible. Ray's nose now. Looking at Scorpion over by stairs. Are they going to be able to get this, though? Oh, oh gets snuck oh. up on by the Rays. I was surprised, even for me. I didn't even <laughs> see him there. 11 to 7. Two away from CBC. Are we going to see the timeout? A little desperate. They do have a timeout, but I I think they're too confident. I don't think they want to do it. A little yeah. nervous might be the wrong move. Move. Booze. There. <laughs> 
might might not be the right direction to yeah. take. I think that timeout might be good for them, we especially this late into the game. Maybe mm. give them another opportunity to bring it back. But yeah, we do have money here. It's a three-two split. Trying to get some pressure there on A with the sky, Just doing some little taps, little sprays. We need to win this one. This one's important. We mm. lose this one, we have no money for the last round. Jeez, getting ready with the nades. They nade each other. It's like some damage there. Raze goes for the jump in. Backs up a little bit. Tries to, you know, save their butt. It's the most important spot. Okay, it looks like they're holding B. Sky, or Raze waiting for reinforcements on CT. They're all on site. I like your support, of course. Mm -hmm. I think CBC good you know some of the damages don't. Raise with the ult, out, goes for the ult, gets one with it. Two kills from Cheese, gets the nade out, gets killed by double kill. Trade it though, Th three v one for Vandals. Finding our Gonna last. So that defuse and Scorpion gets the kill. Look at that. We came back, we're and figuring of course it gonna out. Gonna give the ult to, to Killjoy. Get her all points back up. Mm. Those are gonna be really neat later. And of course, like I said, that one, most important round. We need to have won that one. We win that one. We have a high chance of winning the next ones. We win this one. We win the game. Best of three. Like usual. It's, it's usual how most of our tournaments go. Of course, this one is just a, a scrim. This one isn't for, you know, like uh, any league or anything. It's not super important if you lose this, but you Would will. Would be nice to show off. Hey, a little yeah, bit. Show off. Your ego might get hurt. You know, <laughs> don't want to lose that. Might use just a good showcase going uh, into our preseason here. Yeah. Show off the Vandal might. Looks like they're going for a full rundown B. Get ready with that class. Sky Dog, like gets eliminated right at the last second there. Spike planted. Blood trying to get a pick off one. Getting sprayed, just straight. I was gonna break that wall right there. He's coming up with the flank from CT. Grenade out. A lot of kills there. 4v2 now. Good kills from Viper. Too good for the Vandals over here. Last player. Oh, 4v1. 12 and 8. It's hard. It's, it's hard over here. You know? I, I, I feel the pain. I'm wondering why they're not taking that timeout, though. I mean, they could take it now. Might be beneficial. Maybe. I would like to see the Vandals just take another four minutes.
on. Can we down? Welcome back, Vandals, to our scrim against Columbia Basin College up in Pasco, Washington. We're entering game three now, uh, going on to Icebox with all the fun new changes on this map. On the Vandal side, we have the KO, Sova, Sage, Viper, and Jet Comp. Very reliable group. Sage very commonly played on Icebox. See your walls and her mollies. Or slows used very, very well. On Columbia Basin side, we have Sky, KJ, Sova, Jet, and Viper. Viper, obviously, very reliable for these tighter corners with those snake bites and their walls. Very commonly used on Icebox. Sky, Sova as well. Looking for some interesting uh, competition, as per usual, with these two teams. We have Columbia Basin starting off on A side, going in for that full push, as we normally Caution. see. Jet leading the pack. Looking for the first engage. KJ taking some shots on Kiwi. The initial engagements failed, so we have CBC falling back maybe changing some direction or just maybe stalling yeah. for a little bit of time before they push in spike is leaving going through spawn it is uh it is possible that we could see a mid or maybe a b push and might look like a b push as we have more people sneaking towards b meanwhile we have a 2-1-2 push from the vandal side just waiting for any more engagement that they could be finding sova is playing behind playing through mid trying to play flank on their team and maybe looking for some picks that they can get. Can't use this yet. Heal. Viper holding box, looking the wrong way. Glancing back towards left. that entry, pulling up their wall. Via Jet looking for that first engagement. Blood taking Viper and Jet out. PCUV finding that trade Dohyun. Finding two. It's a 2v3. Spike is not standing. down yet. Ten seconds left. Ah. From a four pinch, CBC is able to take out the last Vandal. Take that first pistol round. Devastating indeed. I apologize uh, that my friend Jamie is not here. He's in the bathroom right now. I thought he had to pee. Might be... A little bit more, because he's still gone. But who knows? Having a uh, more of a three-two split seems, or Here. we're full stacking a no, Here. yeah, three-two split two, maybe towards mid. Viper's at least playing mid, but the rest of CBC oh. is playing a as per usual. We have Do Yun. Finding that first engagement, taking that first kill on Kiwi with the Guardian. Some she's finding some damage with the classic, but ultimately getting dead by Mallow. Skinless finding Mallow, Fallen finding Skinless, Pisa finding Scorpion, and Skinless finding uh, whoever the Sova is. The kill feed refreshed too fast. It is a 1v3 fight. Blood is severely at a disadvantage playing with a classic here. They might need to look around, see if they can find anybody else, find any other guns that might give them better advantage here. But piece of rain from above, call her Farah, because KJ is shooting down at him, getting that final kill, giving another kill or another round to uh, CBC here. Gun here. Taking a more approach to the stream. Get a lot more into me. <laughs> Would like to take some time to say thank you to all of our viewers today. Anyone who has followed today. Although you have not been specifically recognized, you have been acknowledged. We do appreciate all of our viewers. All of you coming here to uh, support our vandals. Or CBC. If CBC is not streaming. I don't know what they're doing with this. Have CBC going up, Kitchen. Peeking out 
the window. Skinless finding Malo. Sky finding Skinless Spike Blood, finding beat. Viper. Sky finding Blood and Pisa finding Scorpion. It's a 2v3 fight right That's now. A lot of engagement standing. in mid. Kiwi playing with the Vandal on mid. Looking for the rest of CBC. Piece of finding some damage out on Kiwi, but they're ultimately going to play with the rest of their team. Just slowly rotating the B right now. They know it's wide open. We still have Kiwi making our way over there. Planted. Slowly moving through. Not doing too much. They know they're at a severe disadvantage here. They don't have any information on positions. They only know that the spike is down. Sky throwing out their dog, having that position. Soba peeking out, but Kiwi just better. Taking that kill. They know the spike is in an exposed position, and KG's Molly's are on it. It's just not looking good for Kiwi here. Time is running out. They're able to tap Spike. Get that one kill on Sky. Reloading middle of open. They're not going to be able to get the fuse, so they have to run from site to save. Actually well played from Kiwi. And even though it was unsuccessful for the Vandals, still saw some excellent gameplay there. Seems like they're really starting to figure some things out. And Icebox is definitely a map that needs some time to figure out, you know. It's uh, it's a big map, kind of like Breeze in that way. And also, uh, there's been a, a lot of time spent away from Icebox. I don't, I don't know how much practice our Vandals have on the map. But, uh, I don't know. They're still trying to figure some stuff out. We're 0-3 now going into round four. Sumchi's finding that first pick on piece of peak of piece of piece of these of no idea. So I have CBC trying to figure out what to do. We have the spike still back towards A. Possibly slowly rotating to B. Some of our vandals looking for some engagement. Uh, through mid, Mallow finding a kill on Ao. The rest of our Vandals slowly moving back. Viper getting taken out by Scorpion. Scorpion only finding that one there. P sub, but with a V. P cub, so it's P cub. I see. It's a hard to see. Thank you for that correction. I appreciate it. Malo finding that kill on some cheese and Dohyun finding the last one on Kiwi, getting another point for CBC here. Clearly the stronger competitor, very confident on Icebox here. Now I would like to reintroduce Jamie hey to guys. the stream back from his bathroom break. Glad to be back. Cool. Appreciate you joining us. I need I needed I needed a break. My voice was starting to kill me. We see a break from Vandals here. Yeah. Already on Finally. round four, or round five, timeout. That is a quick timeout. For you know medals. what? But definitely need it. You know, they haven't won a single round going That's into true. this they game. They needed the timeout so far. From last game. And I would definitely appreciate if they use yeah. the timeout as opposed to. Yeah, I heard them like talking, right? I heard them talking before yeah. before I came in. What th one of the things that they were talking about is like they're upset that, that, that um, CBC, like they. They're really good at playing together. Their mm. communication is really good. They said wherever they go, no matter what, they're, they're being covered by another angle. There's at least two of them in all places. So they're, they're kind of worried about how good they play together. Mm. And, like, we've seen some great plays from, from CBC today. Although there's definitely a lot to learn from them. Definitely a lot That's to true. learn. Mm -hmm. That's true. They have plays set up, like whole, whole plays and strategies yeah. going into either role, defender or attacker. So it definitely makes things a little bit more difficult for yeah, the Vandals and I here. Think, I mean, I'm, I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that Icebox is another map that the Vandals aren't that good at. Um, I mean, so. I want to know. I think this is one of the first times I've seen them play it yeah, I ever mean, since it's re-entered the yeah, map pool. I mean, I don't want to say what our main maps are, but I don't think it's Icebox. <laughs> Also, do keep in mind, Icebox is just re-entering the competitive yeah. pool, uh, especially with all of its changes. Mostly, yeah, we see some good B's plays here off the bat. To run. Seeing that enemy Sova yeah, old, Sova old off the bat. Tag KO a couple times. Yeah, we see some good plays here. Trying to get the pick on Viper, thinks that he killed her, picked away, peeking back from Cheese. 
Oh, oh it looks like you guys aren't even able to see this. That's kind of embarrassing. Oh, oh my nice god, skinless! There, skinless, it's not even on What's stream, a back though. to back to back? Looking for that fourth. About to throw out that blind. Yeah, production. Let's make sure. We're oh! Game, that was a sick a 4K. That wasn't 4K. even on stream. That wasn't even clipped. I feel so bad. I hope somebody got that. Hopefully, one of our players. Yeah, production. Uh, there we go. There it is. After the after the epic play has happened. Unfortunate. But you know what? Hey, that. I that's good. I, I hope I they clipped it. I, I, I think that's huge morale. That, I think that that's was huge great. Morale. That honestly, that, that play from Skinless was great. That was best. One of the best plays we've seen today. Down. Nice knife from KO. The deep knife. That's a classic Free KO pay on this map. Finding Try to, but pain. they might be baiting it. Looks like they're backing off to be with that sky flash. They might have predicted the Sova. Sova's backing up off of that. They're pushing up through mid two, trying to take up as much space as possible. Throwing that mid smoke might be a mid push to be. Yeah, and of course with all the ice block changes, it's like you know there's a lot of uh, uh, interesting things happening. Places to play around. So. Yeah, Sova hiding towards tunnel, up towards kitchen, slowly moving up. Probably going to peek towards window soon. Backing away from yeah, it looks again. Like they might be re pushing on A. Going for that KO fake doesn't rotate. Interesting play. Yeah, Jet and Sky starting to push up. Jet with the with the jump peaks over there. We see the knife coming out. The nice little glides. They're kind of predicting it though. You see they're kind of slow pushing the crouch walk even. Crouch walk is actually really smart because when you peek together, one's low, one's high. They boom double shoot you. So That's true. Hard to play around. Yeah. Got the dart on the jet. Jet's able to dodge it, though, so they don't think that she's there. Waits for the three pings. Pushes out. Sees one up there. Shoots him through the wall. Nice play. Oh, they another get the one. Down. 2K from Cheese Failed there. It's to a find 4v3. Third. KO is down, making it a 3v2. Will they get the KO up? Looks like they're trying. Yeah, we get the KO up. 3 to 2. Kill the sky. Oh. Elites both or all of her uh, onions there. Cabbages. <laughs> Nice plays there. I was a little bit worried. Uh, I, I have seen Sky try and use this play where they'll use their ult as a as a shield in a way and try and play in front of it, but gotcha, yeah. Taken out too quickly. Yeah, trying to bait those shots away. Didn't seem to work. Looks like Skinless has the nice uh, what is that? The Grava something knife. Here. Grava taunt? No, I hmm, I'm not hundred percent sure. It's a nice knife though. I, I honestly wish I got that one. Not a big fan of the Vandal from that bundle, but the knife's pretty nice. Looks like we're going for a one-two-one -one split for the Vandals. It's gonna be interesting play. Viper's trying to get the lineup, <laughs> missing all the shots though. Oh, is that gonna be it? This is oh, again. <laughs> Looks like they're gonna go for a B execute from CBC. Poison orb emitting. Spotted. Oh, there it is. The one-way poison. Poison. Oh, Sumchi's finding that nice first kill there. on the enemy Viper. Holding that angle, the attacker killed Joy you know, with that with that <laughs> ultimate right there. It's gonna be hard to play around. Mm -hmm. Gotta back up Our though. Vandal's having to escape the site. They didn't get any of us. Scorpion two kills there from Scorpion. Ah. One enemy. finding one on Molo. Three v one gets taken down by uh, Soba, yeah, and then Cheese goes for the trade. Yeah, it looks like we're starting to clutch these up. We're starting to learn how they play, get their play style. We're trying to, you know, communicate around how good they are at communicating. Mm. CBC, really good strong suits playing together, playing those those uh, as a team. And it looks like we're, we're starting to do that too. We're starting to get the morale up. We're starting to get these dubs. And, and we're coming, you know, finding some more wins from it. So Yeah. Yeah. Going in around eight here, three, v, uh, three to four in CBC favor. Talking like an NPR reporter. I gotta stop. What is my what is my timing here? Um, seeming like CBC is going for that A push. Yeah, that deep knife right there. Mm. Good old, old reliable. Oh, not Except going Skinless knife, is actually. not going for oh, it. Going for it. Throws a knife nest. Gets okay. two. Doesn't spot the rest of the team though, so they might think it's a, uh, a fake. They do know this guy's there. That's at least three that they know is on site. Viper with the snake bite. Dog on site. They're pushing site with the ultimate. Able nice. to take on the jet ultimate. Nice. Takes out Skin three. Skin fighting three. Four and four. No. 
Nice. Oh, oh, fighting so much damage on that ace. silver, looking for. Oh. oh, he kills himself to stop the that's, ace. Oh, that's no. that's that is some kind of spite. They were. <laughs> That is three. awful. Oh, they they were looking for it. They were scared. They were like, nope, nope. I'm I'm just gonna get okay, myself okay. before they get me. I don't me. know about you. That seems kind of <laughs> unsportsmanlike. That that's a little unsportsmanlike, isn't nah, it? Nah, nah, man. You you can't let the world take you out. You, just, you gotta get to him first. No. Nah. <laughs> that is messed up. I agree with I, you. I was unsure what they were going for there. I thought they were just gonna run away. I think, you know, the rest of their team did fall Nice so knife, trying to quickly, bait that though. KO, but the KO knife doesn't see anything. Oh no, it sees three actually through the wall going mid. But you know, could be going A, could be going mid, doesn't even know. There looks like they're re-executing on A, pushing up through sight, going towards nest. We have some backside as well. Looking for those peaks. Playing off contact. We KO is the only one on site. Sees the Viper Wall. Gets ready with the flash. KO, it's it's fine though. We've seen some really good plays from KO. I goes for the flash. Oh, oh, misses the shots though. Pico. Nice play from, from Sova here. Get, trying to get at least a couple kills with his ult. Isn't able to make any connect though. It's a 3v5. Snake bites coming out to stop the entry. Going up into nest, looking through the rope. Doesn't see anything though. Starting to push. The Sova Dart sees Scorpion though. Trying to back up, trying to save his life. Backs up with the Sova Dart. Jet, though, right on the edge of the wall. Sprays her through the wall. Dies, though, with the trade. So she's playing with the op. Are we going to see some impressive edge. plays with the op? One flash here. Does have their ult. It's a Getting sprayed through Nest. Misses the oh. shot on the sky. One there coming up is. to his Charming. left. Is he going to see it? Oh. Connects with the headshot. The rest oh, look yeah. like they're saving in the spawn. He might go mid, though. Might play for the aggressive, you know, try to ruin their eco. Nah, nah, we'll see how it goes. Saves the op. Looks like he's being pushed from mid. Just let him try. Yeah, good to save the op, though. Probably shouldn't have peaked that at 12 HP. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tense. I think, it's, I'm trying to, I think it's the Gravitonium. That makes sense. That sounds right, but I feel like it might also be wrong. <laughs> Gravitonium bundle. Gravitational, is that it? No, no, no. Gravi no, gravitonium. Gravitational uranium is a different is a different bundle. Well, we see some plays coming in here. Oh, yeah. no Holding with the op. Here comes the the Sova ult. Looks like it might be another B A push. Viper's trying to take up as much space with her ult right there. Holding those hard angles. They're kind of defaulting in spawn, trying to play off those picks. Don't really know how to play around that Viper. That's the issue here. Playing for contact. Looks like we have four mid, one spawn. Just trying to hold that long angle. Waiting for contact. Skin was throwing that knife in the A. TBC still taking some time. Playing together, leaving mid, going through A main instead. KJ keeping their eyes out. Any stragglers behind their team. Skin was making some noise, not knowing that the rest left. of the team is playing up there. Oh, it's the Chrono Void. That was a hard seat. That was the name of the... <laughs> that was the name of the knife. Okay, good pick there from KJ. Another pick there from Scorpion. Some she's pulling out their ult and using the Another pick. I miss the he off shot. He's Ten seconds left. Miss all those shots from KJ. <laughs> Finally hits that last one in the leg. Gets Ooh, a nice one two. on Sova. Waiting for the third. Oh, not, oh, not getting it. the third. 2v1, though. But An blood easy finishing clean off up. the rest of the Hawks, yeah, I have yeah. learned. Um, apparently, see. CBC is the Hawks. Hawks. Vandals versus the Hawks. I mean, we've already seen from primitive times the Vandals were able to get rid of the Hawks, right? Were they? <laughs> I don't know. I think that's Greek history? I mean, if you think about it, right? An angry Vandal man with a spear against a bird who would win. 
go with Depends if he's got that aim. He's got that skinless that's true. aim. That's true. <laughs> does the, does the Vandal have that skinless aim? Does the Vandal aim? have that skinless spear aim? Charlie Mike, let's move. We need a tagline for skinless. I think he's literally skinning the enemies. Like, there's nah, no other way to yeah, phrase that. Yeah, it's, uh, it's looking dangerous for him over here. And he holds A really well. Not th or throwing that knife yeah, out. Yeah, waiting for the noise. Pushing up. The ult knocks down the ultimate, though. CBC just loves Seekers are still going to come out, though. Seeker skinless finding that first on by the Seeker. Throws out the nade. Misses it, though. Can waiting to push angle. out. Throws oh! It oh, the timing. Oh, it's a shot. Nice. Three bullets. Oh, out of ammo. One on him right now. Throws the upper hand. Viper with the What is he doing? Nice oh, ace from Skinless. Check the computer. What is he doing? It was, it was stolen the first time. Finally got it the next. I hope CBC learns their lesson. That was a is great. Out very yeah, well honestly, <laughs> I think the lesson to learn here is do not push skinless. No, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. Jesus, we got the menace out here. Out of his mind. Yeah, we saw some good plays from skinless the last two maps, but this map, skinless is carrying the immortals. Good plays here. Detects the two. Split push so far, but Jet is holding towards back. B. Yeah, Spike is on B. B main. B main. Oh. Rest of the Vandals just waiting Killjoy for any out. additional information. Jet making our first move, dashing out into a visible space. Letting Sova lead. Meanwhile, Viper is playing through mid. Sky Pushing spots that under smoke. There. Not finding anything quite yet. You should run. Place is down there. This is locked down. Down at the bolt. Rest of the vandals. Backing up to mid. Still mid. trying to hold though. Of course, you know, CPC is going to capitalize off the investment. Push through site with the ult. Detects no one on site. Holding mid. They're going to try to go for that plant. Gets that plant down. Sees the phantom right there. Peaks. Hits the headshot. Good plays there from G's. Grabs the Specter. That's a play. Knows the stuff is there. Just dropped. <laughs> nice shots from Jacob right there on uh, the Sova. I saw it coming. Can we get a quick scoreboard check? Let's see. Let's see the standing. Yeah, so we can see Skidless 17 to 7. That is some great plays right there. He's going. Dohyeon, of course, top fragging, of course. Mm. Up there, 9 to 9. Non negative. Yeah, going no even. Even. Yeah. Yeah, pretty good. It looks like, you know, go, of course you go Ghost. Ghost, I think Ghost on pistol is the best gun. Yeah, absolutely. Because Sheriff, Sheriff might do the most damage, but you don't but need you don't need the 159 damage on first round That's on pistol. True. The, the Ghost can one-shot headshot by itself, and it's cheaper. Hmm. So... Unless if you're incredibly confident in your ability to, in, unless if you're skinless. But it's like you skinless don't. Skinless is the only person you I'd don't excuse. Need Look at him. He's playing oh, classic. Oh, he's going classic. See, classic. That confident. Classic's good, but it takes two shots to even head, like two headshots to kill. That's true. The glitch pop classic, though. That's a, that's a nice gun. Yeah. Going keep. out with the drone. They're pushing up on the right there. They got they got the one way viper smoke as well. Going ready with the the knife. Throws a knife out. Doesn't make contact. Successful. But Sees them long, jumps out of it, but gets detected. Pushes forward to spraying, trying to keep them at bay while they plant. Oh. Gets a nice kill on the trade. It's a 4v4. Kiwi's at 20 HP. Might heal herself. Yep, heals herself. Holds those angles. Sees one close. Sees them. Get, Kiwi She's gets a walking. spray kill. Two of them no are pretty low. Her, yeah. her heal's going down. She's one at 50 HP. So 4v1. Don't know where he is, though. There ah. goes Jacob with the kill on Sova. How wonderful. Yeah, we've seen to see that almost reverse sweep skinless doing a lot of the heavy lifting towards the end of last half, and then... Vandal's finding those I mean, first couple rounds yeah. after the switch. Yeah, the four, the f zero to four, eight to five is crazy. We got eight rounds. They got one. That's honestly. I'm I'm glad.
to see the comeback. I'm Honestly, glad to the, see the turnaround. Uh, it's a comeback and a half, but will they be able to hold on to the lead? Will they still carry with the advantage? That's the question. It looks like they're not forcing all too much here, but but we'll see how it goes. Pushing forward onto side jet on. What is that? Pushes for two Sova, sees that he's weak. Oh, misses the shots though, get treated or gets shot by the Jets. A 4v4. Throws the snake by, try to get him a little bit of chip damage off of them. Hits the Sova, backs up, gets kill on the Killjoy right there. They just push forward. It's a 4v1 and they one by get one by one. the win. Of course, they did have an advantage there. They had the we the weapon advantage, they had the gun advantage. Uh, looks like they're going for Spectre here, Vandal as well, because I think Jet might have full saved and just went with the Ghost still mm. in the last round. Which, I mean, it is an interesting play. You can see at least one Vandal would be helpful to have here. I think it was a good play. Although, Dojon is broke, and he's playing Sheriff's true. Shield. It's true. I think he might have tried to force last round. I think so, yeah. Tried to capitalize on something, get those guns out of the Vandal's hands, but just wasn't really effective. Mm. Pushes forward with the Spectre. Snake bite damages the Sova a bit. Unfortunate. They all hard push up B main. It's going to be a brawl here. Oh, Gets two, two. Trades two, with the Malo. It's a 3v4. 3v3. Two oh my five. god. Oh, it's getting dangerous. Sheriff over wins. Here. Two trade, two. trade, trade. That's all that's happening right now. Definitely some even competition. Last player standing. Oh, it was a 1v2 right there. Vandal's pushing forward, trying to grab that spike. They don't know where the last one is. Sky watching mid, but here's the spike get picked up. So rotates back to B main. Might expect the B main push. Wall goes up, you know, getting rid of info for Sky. Might throw the flash of the smoke, figure out where they are. They're speed running up to plant area. Yeah. Look at him go. Sky has going ready. No Sky just trying idea. to hold those angles. Well, because like that that wall and the gates yeah. information on the sky, she could have chose to flash through it, but then she would have had no more flashes or Not wait for the yet. rotate. Looks like she waited for the rotate, kind of mm. go run over to mid. It looks like Should go really interesting. Dogs first. Dogs out. Dog instantly killed. Goes for the Sova dart. The snake bike. Blinded. Oh. Kills the Sova. It's a one v one. Not sure what Scorpion was going for there. Blood playing a little bit more careful, letting letting her play close. Close up. Is Sky gonna expect that she is They're right playing. behind? Ring around the Four Rosie bullets here. left in Blood's magazine. Literally ring Just around the Rosie. In. They don't know where each other are. Goes for the defuse. Fakes. Oh, oh, and that is a kill from Sky, taking it to nine to six. Able to get the spike. Clutch. Two seconds left on don't that countdown. Try. Yeah, plenty of time, honestly. It was a little close. I thought they were gonna go for another revolution there. And just keep spinning. Orbit in a little. Uh... Yeah, honestly, a jump peek there would have been a smart idea because it takes what four or five seconds. I think it's four seconds. But also, use. you saw how, so. how low Sky was. That's I true. think it was. That just could have been like honestly, could have a like, single bullet, made single bullet, single foot shot would have killed her. Mm. This has been a great game great skim against cbc thank you so much cbc for willing to scrim with the vandals this has been a great game on both sides we see some great plays from everyone we see it's a full run down a get the dart one uh sage kills cheese good pick there from say or from sova there tries nope. to go for the taps as well our dart goes out wall comes up I'm gonna grab that orb. Sage is very close to the old. Blood finding one on backing up. 4v4. Grab the spike. spike. Looks like we might be defaulting, just playing off of the, the contacts. We're pushing up mid, holding that flank just in case he try to push us up through mid. We do have mid smoked off, which is beneficial for us. Um, but like I said, this could be anyone. Going back, reviving him. Yeah, so we wanted to run to, to A, grab the Ultorb, go back. Because we need this round. This round's important. You know, we're low on eco. Mm. Um, so we kind of need to win this round. So that we'll revive on Jacob was a really smart idea right there. Left. Pushing side, executing. Snake bites come out. Tries to break the, the KJ util. Push your side. One's coming up on the Raptors, it looks like. Hits the spike down. 
Might as well hold those angles. Up. Nice shots from Skinless and Scorpion on the other two. Mallow gets one, Sun Cheese gets one, and it trades back with Skinless. An impressive round from the Vandals here. Skin, we, like As I said, usual, Skinless has been a very, very great addition to the team. Absolutely. I mean, you see what I he's doing. I he's think, having his day. honestly, worth the pick. We had some really great people come out for tryouts. I think Skinless was the choice. Absolutely. Honestly, it was the choice of all time. Valorant Hunter, if you will, for those of us who are fans of the other Vandal teams, including the Smash team. Hopefully we see some good plays coming out right now. We see them go for that full A push. They look like they might have expected the full push. Going back, Jet pulls the ult out. Ult gets gone by the KO, suppressed on the Jet. She still has him, just has to wait 10 seconds. Goes for the nade as well. Snake bits hit, sorry, Snake bites hit back sight. They're pushing up. Scorpion's gonna go watch that flank. He catches the flank. 4v4, actually 3v4, got the classic kill on Skinless. Trade after trade, it's now a 3v2. They see one more Raptors with a classic, it looks like. Last two backside, last one Raptors, taken out by both of them on a collaboration on both. That was a really good play. Maybe, maybe Icebox is their map. Honestly. Maybe, maybe Game we sense were missing crazy. four. Honestly, th this has been great. We've seen some really great mutual plays. Because here's the thing, right? We were talking about it before, like I said, when I came back here. Um, the Vandals were worried about the, the Hawks because they have some really good communication. They're really good at playing together. And when they play together, there's usually multiple of them playing in one area at a time. So it's hard to get those kills. But with what we've been doing, you know, we've been trying to do the exact same thing. We've been coming together. We've been uh, bringing together our forces. We've been collaborating even more. And the communication and our game sense, I feel, has improved in the last, what, 11 rounds, yeah. zero to four. Yeah. Now we're 11 to six. Yeah. So we've been doing some some great plays. Mm. Some great improvement. Great improvement. For sure. Going yeah. up 11, okay. Timeout's six, almost now. over. I was hoping we could see almost a repeat of what we saw from the first round, but yeah. I think we're a little bit over that. Maybe. <coughs> I don't know. All right. Let's Maybe see what they uh, pull out now. What CBC needs. Who knows? All right, we see Skinless coming up to mid. Because the, the thing about timeouts, right, is while it um, gives the, uh, like, CBC a timeout as well, mm. it also gives the Vandals a timeout. Mm. Now, of course, they're not able to talk with their coach like CBC can, but it gives them time to think about what they want to do, and it looks like what they want to do is run it down mid. <laughs> Throws that interesting... Uh, smoke, but it looks like it's actually quite beneficial. Allows him to rotate to mid. Gets the pick from Sa uh, Sofa there. Double oh. pick. Talks him low. It's 3v5. Trying to get the pick on that Sova right there. They got to try to keep those guns safe as well. Don't want the, the Hawks to get those guns. Dodges the Sova drone on that little quick little rotate to Kitchen. Wall goes out mid to stop that. Watch mid. Gets shot from B main. They're kind of all trapped. It's a 3v4, so it could be anyone's round, but it's it's difficult about what the play is here because they're all kind of grouped up together, all close. They don't know where each other are. Scorpion gets another kill there. Kiwi with the ult. Tries to catch him through fence. Kiwi gets killed by the Sova ultimate. 8 HP on the Sova. Sova v Sova here. Nice shot there. And gets shot by the Sheriff from Snowman. Hate to see it. It looks like we, we do have plenty of money, though. We have plenty yeah. of money for, for guns and for buys, of course. Uh, but it looks like they do as well. So th this could be interesting play. Yeah. I know. I just look. It's, yeah. it's looking a tiny bit rough. Just yeah, and if you look bit. at our credits, we are down. So this next round is going to be very important. We of win course. this next round. Mm -hmm. We win, of course, the round 13. Mm -hmm. But it, it's been very difficult because, you know, we're so low that it's it's this round is so important. Yeah, we cannot we're, let we're them take hanging our on by a thread, really. Yeah. Looks like they're gonna hard push B again. There's no one on B. Cage is running over though to kitchen. They basically have a free sight, but they just don't even know it yet. 
Viper Wall goes up. KJ comes running over. So does Sova. They predict that there's no one there. This might be a fake, though. They're going back to A. Some pressure on mid from Viper and Sky peeking out. They have a, that turret on mid, though, that could spot them. Interesting Boxes plays here. Down. Looks like they might be executing on A. That wall there from Viper just denies all that information. Sky goes out, detects them on A. We see a quick rotate over from Viper, from Save, from Sova, from KJ. They're just running over onto site. We saw the K ult get popped. They're just going to hard execute with all of their util. Get that spike planted. There goes the knife. See who's on site with it. Gets killed by Mallow. Traded on by Skinless. Traded by the Sky. It's a 2v4. Spike is not down. Right here. They're just gonna try to hold that as much as possible. Playing off contact. Here comes a dog. Dog might have saw her up there. Kinda 30 seconds left. Here. They're waiting to see if they come out and rotate, but it doesn't look like it. Sova's pushing up through mid. This could be quite interesting if they Sova wraps all the way around. Wait, kills this Viper. To make their moves Sky is weak on back side. I have this bike. Gets the, are they going to get the plant down? They just have to hold it off for a couple more seconds. Gets the plant down, unfortunately. Okay. It's a 2v2. One's up top. One's on site. Kills the one on site. It's a 1v1 situation. 30 HP versus full HP. This could be interesting. Just trying to hold those angles. We've seen this happen <laughs> once before with blood around the Rosie situation. Places the turret, but doesn't place it toward KJ. Doesn't know where she is. Goes for the defuse. And gets it, of course. Now, we, played it a lot we more did win this that. Time. We did win that. However, the downfall is we are down on Eco. That's true. By a lot. So we either have to Except force this as much as possible. doing really good for himself right now. Honestly, it could buy someone else as well, yeah. Mm. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, so it looks oh, like yeah. we do have Definitely guns. Drop. Thank you. Yeah, there we go. Skinless getting bought that vamp. Going into round 20. Two ults on each team. Get out of my Most way! Of the KJ ult, though, is probably going to be popped this round. R quick rundown with the stinger! Oh, Pulls the ult crazy. out. Dodges away, gets killed. Almost catches the Sova. Sova's quite able to get away. It's a 3 to 4. The Vandals could still clutch this. Sage comes out, puts up the wall, tries to get the plant down. They break right through it, though, with the Seekers. Still the 3v4, trying to hold Snowman. They know that one Snowman, they see the sprays come out. Sova's Shock Dart comes out. Skydog running it down. They quickly break it, though. Do they see the one that's on them right now? Do they not catches it. Viper's right Spike there. Down, Gets Ooh, the, the kill on right Viper. 2v2 situation. Will they win it? They have no ults on either team. They do have util though. Here comes the Sova ult from us now after grabbing the orb. Waiting for the contact on the sky. Gonna try to get the plant down, but Sky could just quickly wrap around, shoot, shoot, win. So we gotta keep that help. Will they find the sky? That is the question. Finds the sky ah, with the trade, and that is a Vandal win. GG's to the Vandals and GG's to CBC, Columbia Basin College. Absolutely. This has been a great game, a great showcase of the incredible talent that we have on both teams. We can see Skinless, of course, the 22-12. That was really impressive. Absolutely. Honestly, and especially, like we've said many times, mm. being the new addition to the... Uh, the, the Valorant fam, the Valorant team, mm. we've seen some great plays from them, honestly. Yes. And I'm glad to see what comes out more of our following games. Just make sure you guys stay tuned. So when are our following games, do you know? I feel like I should, and I don't. Um, do we have any information on that? Uh, I know because things are going to be a little more complicated following the schedule this year because we're not only playing in Nays, but we're also playing in ECAC. That is true. New stuff going on this semester as i've mentioned in previous streams before obviously but um even then uh for a preseason match i think this was a pretty good showcase yeah. pretty good opportunity to show off uh our vandals abilities go vandals v's up 
Yeah, uh, let's, we're sitting around waiting for an interview. Yeah, let's run that trailer, that Beak Bunk trailer, one more time. If you guys haven't heard about Beak Bunk, or do you live under a rock? Just make sure you watch this trailer. Check it out. Four thousand five hundred dollar prize pool. Let's get that rolling. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Welcome back, Vandals. Uh, run that ad three times now. Hopefully you've gotten it through your head. Beak Bunk is happening. See us here at the University of Idaho, Moscow, Idaho. Uh, but in the meantime, to close out the stream, we have an interview with Valorant's captain, Some Cheese. Welcome to the table, my friend. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Good to be here after a pretty good win today. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. We saw some epic performances from both teams, of course. Um, saw some maps that I don't think I've ever seen the Vandals play. Saw some amazing ice block, uh, ice box strategies and plays there today. Mm -hmm. uh, overall, just like how how was today? You know, playing against Columbia Basin. Uh, first things first. Before I say anything about my team, I just want to say GG's to Columbia Basin. Those guys are crazy, <laughs> like for sure. Like that was our first game as a new team, and they gave us perfect competition. That was mm -hmm. the best games I could have asked for. We went to the third map, and it was so close. Oh my gosh, like those guys are crazy, seriously. But uh, overall, you know, great start, obviously, to the season, to this off season, I guess. But first scrim, first win, you know, we'll take that with our new guy, Skinless, today. Did super good, and especially on Icebox. Oh my gosh. Oh, he had God. an ace, he had a four. Oh my gosh, he's crazy. <laughs> so, gotta give respect to him. But very fun, honestly, 100%. Super fun. Yeah. yeah. Well, speaking of Skinless, actually, um, I mean, now that we've seen his performance, I think it's kind of obvious why he was picked. But, like, <laughs> while we were going through tryouts, what was going through your head as you saw him play? You know, we saw some nice plays from him during tryouts as well. Mm. Did you kind of know from the start that he was going to be your fifth for this year? Actually, yeah, no, we didn't. So <laughs> <laughs> we, we kind of went through a process um, the last week when we did the tryouts. All the, me and, I, and it wasn't just me. It was, like, the whole team and mm. our coach, actually. We had a couple guys that were like, okay, we're interested in these guys, and we want to make sure – the guy we want is the guy we really want because once we choose that guy, we're stuck with him, you know, for of the course. whole season. And not only, like, was he obviously mechanically good, as you saw, but he fits in great with our chemistry, our team, and we all like him. We all think he's chill, so that helps out a lot. And clearly his performance <laughs> showed today. So yeah. We're really happy with that. And, yeah, he's, he's an awesome guy, so we'll take that for sure. Yeah. And then, uh, of course, as traditional preseason fashion, I have to ask, uh, what are you looking forward to with this season? I know you're playing in NACE, you're playing in ECAC. Got a lot more things going on for you uh, for the spring semester. Uh, I just want to know any, like, outlook stuff going on. You know, honestly, all I care about is that I improve and my team improves. That's all that matters to me. You know, it doesn't matter how many losses we take. What matters to me is that we improve. And if we're staying the same, like, bad all season that's that's obviously we're not improving that's what i don't want yeah i want to make sure that i can help them improve they help themselves improve and overall we just become better as a team that's my whole goal always so Hell otherwise yeah. you know be nice to win maybe a finals win a lot of games this season <laughs> let's see what happens you know i don't want to jinx anything though so yeah, <laughs> yeah. well always rooting for you over here at the cast sure. table uh it was nice having you here awesome to see you play once again i'm excited to see you play later on the season thank you very much yeah it's great to be here appreciate yeah. it and uh, to the rest of our viewers, thank you for coming. Uh, thank you for sticking around to support your team. I know we had some CBC fans earlier this stream, so thank you for coming out to, I mean, just be here. 
uh, support your friends, uh, support the stream, follow us, or don't. I'm, I can't make you do anything. Um, but yeah, no, overall, had a great stream today. Thank you for coming, and we will see you again soon. You know how I am with goodbyes, but we'll, we'll, we'll see you later.